a conservative. Hi, movies. Yeah. And the chosen one, Bauer Power El Suario. And I, uh, and hello, cool cat. How are all of you? What's so shitty about this game? <laughs> we're, well, I guess we're about to find out. I have zero expectations of this to surprise me uh, in a positive way. It looks like every shitty YouTube movie ever, except it's a game somehow. You're welcome, Oppo. Alyssa says it has super bad reviews. Oh, I am excited! I hope you guys are excited. What are these? What are these fucking Sakura blossoms? That's a tree, right? Oh. No, wait, cherry blossoms. What the fuck is a Sakura? I know it's a chick from Naruto, but is it not a, like, flower as well? Or a tree? I meant to click settings, but fine, fuck me, I guess. Your choices form one of many perspectives. Ah, the famous, the famous lie of all story games. Ah. Uh -huh. ah, beautiful. Damn, look at these next-gen graphics, bro. So I guess I just control the mouse. A movie you interact with. I'm down for that. I'm down for a very lazy evening. Fuck it. I mean, shit, I've been struggling so much lately, playing like Resident Evil and having to pay attention, having to actually try and whatnot. <laughs> this is not don't know. <laughs> okay, already, I get it. Let's do it. Go. Other way? No. Up. Up. I'm trying. Click. Up. Click up. I have to do it. Oh, why give me the weird prompt on the side then? Hey, Heinz. What? I even have to move the thing to focus the camera? Oh, no. Pop, pop, pop. Yeah, just sit in front of the open fire instead. That's much safer. With your back turned to it. Okay. With your long hair. Ready. Mummy and I met many, many years ago. In a place called Delphi House. What the hell is this? What is going on? She was a nurse. I was a doctor. Was the mom dead? I don't like At that night, smile. We tell each other stories. She tell okay, me no, the I don't think that's out yet. Wonderful things. Is it out? Things only she. I would have trusted see. you guys to tell me if it's released. I tell her about the past, about a great priestess, marked with a butterfly. Butterfly. Who could stare into the fire and see the future? What is this accent? Where's this guy from? I used to tell her she was magic, just like the priestess. I think you're magic too. Where have I seen this but guy before? He's an actual truth. actor, I think. I guess someone look up his Pick name. Your photograph. Pick your favorite. Favorite? I don't know. Wedding photo, I guess. Click. 
Das ist so Irish. Ah, hier, Hannah. Thank you for the gift. Oh, it's those Harry Potter photos. Interactive. Wait, no. Volcano Close High is gonna eyes. be PS5 only? Focus your mind. Why? And conjure the power I don't have a the PS5. That's make that makes me sad. I wanna I wanted to play that game. Now find your home again. I'm gonna go insane. Is this guy like See if Mads Mikkelsen's brother? I wasn't paying attention. What do you want? Oh, disaster. Oh, Boy. never mind. I, I keep... Okay, I still think he looks like it. someone in a German TV show. That's why I got freaked out. She'll always be with you. Remember that. Even though she isn't here... You got the money, but not the patience. Well, fuck. <laughs> At least I'm not paying 900 bucks for PS5. I'm not doing that. And even if I had the money, which, mind you, you don't know, I'm not a, I'm not gonna piss away my money. What do you think you'd see? My microphone is a bit quiet. Yeah. No, it should be normal. Why would it be quiet? Oh, the game's kind of loud in comparison, I guess. My bad. Okay, that should help a little. Let me know if it's too quiet. Oh, and Ezer says it will be on Steam too. Okay. Oh shit! I looked away for one second and Daddy committed seppuku. He got himself like a fish. Oh, is this a detective game? Are we gonna have to... Oh, this is a very normal reaction on her part, I guess. What the fuck? Alright, kids, boys and girls, we're gonna have to, uh... We're gonna have to find the murderer. No cap. Uh, um, as the kids would say, we... We have to find the sussy baka. And hand him over to the bad cops. Because all cops are bad. Just like that blood effect. What? <laughs> why, does it, why does he have a gun and a knife? <laughs> why does he get shanked but the daughter gets shot? <gasps> Is that mother? Never say that garbage again. Yeah. Turn on the tap. There we go. Shing shing. Funny how there there was no reflection of her on the tap. <laughs> okay. Um. Justify? Justify what? I just said that I'll I think we might need subtitles for this. This is such a boring horror movie trope, is a shit where, like, they scribble in all charcoal colors on pieces of paper. You know, just drawing fucked up figures in nightmare shit in black. Ew, it's like that, like, ring home security footage you always see. Like, creepy people getting caught. Stop puking on the stairs, you asshole. Uh, it is Dixie. Why the fuck would I unlock it? You be quiet. You're too quiet. Fuck you. Bitch. Hope the killer kills you next. Oh, 
Uh, Kaiser, it's a movie game. Interactive movie. God, again with this. We get it. You're, you're traumatized and fucked up and this is all you do. Like, why can't somebody just have a traumatic experience and draw fucking, I don't know, nice stuff? Like, I don't know, learn Blender and make a donut, you bitch. Get over it. Instead of this. Like, all this does is perpetuate the trauma. Oh god. Up. Up. No, this... No. Oh, really? What is the point of this if you won't let me draw a swastika? Oh, motherfucker. Oh, wait. Maybe she is drawing a swastika. <laughs> is she based? <laughs> Oh no, never mind. It's more stupid, fucked up imagery. <laughs> Top lawyer murdered. Oh, is it gonna be Dad's head? Oh no. Oh, don't be a dead animal. Please just let it be a human body part. Oh, thank god. <laughs> just a hand. Nani! What crypto logo is this? I killed my dad. I'm Sergeant Blake. The lead investigator on this case. Did you really have to... F like, flex your badge on her? You're obviously with the police, I believe you. I promise I'll give it back. Uh... Sure, who cares? You draw this a lot. Trying to get away. <laughs> it's Greek, isn't it? In Delta Capsule. Same as with your father. I don't know. I'm not a nerd. How do you know that? I read your father's file. I had to. Is it not way too quiet for you guys now? The hand belonged to a Cal Jahar. You worked at Delphi House? I believe you visited there with your father. Dad worked there. Did you know he co founded Delphi House? I don't even know what with that is. This man? Lucian Flowers? British. We think Mr. Flowers might be a target, too. Say something, bitch. Look, we're keeping watch over at Delphi House. Protection detail. I'll be leading the investigation from there. Right now, it's the safest place for you, too. I swear I think the problem with this movie is that it was exactly mixed like a movie, like you guys know how when you're watching a Netflix show, you constantly have to write the volume because during the musical segments it gets so fucking loud but then the dialogue kicks in and it's just so fucking low and you constantly have to adjust it because it was mixed to be viewed in a theater and not on someone's shitty fucking laptop. I think this is exactly what they did with this game which is gonna drive me insane. Where's she going? So the black guy was murdered? Is that the... Is that what's happening here? Is she farting? What the fuck? Oh well. I have to admit, like, some of the effects are kind of cool looking. With the mouse interactively and shit. What if Lady Dimitrescu just came out right now? Stupid man thing! Hey, Bilal. Is 
this like Epstein's estate? Are they gonna molest this girl? Ding. Ding ding. How'd you do that without touching it? Are you psychic? They're probably out for a smoke. Wait here, I'll go check. How old is she even? She looks vaguely underage. Like, is she the warden of the state? Is she an actual adult who gets to make her own decisions? What the fuck is she? Delphi House. What is it? Though? All right, I've seen enough. I don't know. But I definitely do want to do that. Answer the phone. Go. Click. Jesus, how old is that phone? Erica Mason. I have waited a long time to speak to you. Did you It's like Lane Maxwell, watch out. You were so alone. Holding on to your father. I don't know yet, I was so. He's not who you think he was. One Thank you, Purple music. Monkey. Incoming 10 gift subs. Oh my Jesus. <laughs> Thank you. you did, uh, see him for who he really was. Holy it's shit. Everybody got one. Let's see. Father Schlongicus. Tama. Reeks the man slinky and the stinky. Pedic unknown cyborg. Sesh boxes. Eater, eater. Hey, Josh got one. And Pixlr 10. I don't know what Josh was watching. Thank you again, Purple. Why is there pin code safety if the door isn't even locked. And also, where'd everybody go? Um, archive. How long have I been on the official podcast for? Uh, just started. I'm doing my internship. Stuff raped. It's lurking around in some weird fucking Epstein mansion. Oh, please read it. Don't make me read it, please. Fuck. Damn it. Dear Mr. and Mrs. Johnston, I'm so offended that this game is making me actually do something and not doing everything for me. It is with great sadness that we extend our condolences to you and your family. Tiara was such... Tiara was suck such a delightful girl. This is like a fucking draft. Tiara was suck such a delightful girl. Even at the end, she faced her challenges head on and despite her circumstances, which were never less than difficult, she remained true to herself until the last. Plus, find along with this letter her possession switch. I would have added if I didn't have a stroke mid typing. Oh no. Which we are happy to return. Please find and close multiple clothes, personal items. Yeah, yeah. Open 
open sesame. Open it. It has like a weird delay on actually moving on what you click. Come on, don't do me like that. Just fucking zoom in on it. What? Oh. Scribble, scribble. It says... Johar. Yeah, Johar? The fuck is a Johar? Is that a name? 101500. No, I hope the audio isn't fucked up for everyone. Ah, key. Doing some great investigation over here. Wait, did you put the notepad back? Oh well. Alright, go in. Let's go. This is life action. This is actually ray traced. Looks pretty good, doesn't it? For a Life is Strange mod. Like, let's do this, guys. Next person that comes in and just tunes in, and if they ask if this is a movie or a life action, let's troll them and just say it's actually really good graphics. And, like, actually fucking stick with the joke and, you know, completely deadpan. And, uh, gaslight the shit out of him. Who the hell is Carter? <laughs> New Unreal Engine. Yeah, look at the meta-human, you guys. <laughs> oh, thank you, Inverted Phoenix. Tier 2. You guys are being generous today for this fair maiden. Approved Delphi House. Oh, that's our mommy. Committed to inpatient care by inpatient care by DTT or sorry DH seniors residents physicians Peter Mason spouse. Damn, dad had mom admitted. What the fuck? What the hell are you doing here? Hey, she didn't get raped. Congrats. Good for you. Lucky. Oh no, it's a satanic symbol. Oh, that was a waste of time. I see you found someone. Oh, what convenient timing for you to come back to. Man at the desk. Snitch. It's a creep. It's a creep. You were invading his office. You're the creep. Motherfucker, imagine the hubris on this hoe. A entering a man's office that is uh, beyond limits to anybody who's not an employee. Stealing his passwords and rifling through his fucking... <laughs> rifling through his files and private possessions. And she, she has the audacity to say he's a creep. We're a headache. He's got every reason to be on edge. Oh, what's that? The original simp. <laughs> I'm Sergeant Blake. I'm Thank you for the tier three. I'm supposed to meet a Dr. Ballard. Well, perhaps you'd like to ask this young lady what she was doing in my office. I kind of slept on that timer that they so had on screen. I wonder if it was possible to uh, not, not get caught. Oh, yeah, you can change the language channel. Let's check it out. Let's try Arabic, I guess. Can you change mids? And all of a sudden, we're in Saudi Arabia. As you know, you can't just walk around uncovered. We're gonna have to stone you now. Thanks. 
What else do we have? Russian. Nah, you know what? I don't want to read subtitles. I want to do the Death minimal effort. Oh, shit. Come on. It's okay. I uh, appreciate what everyone's doing. Come on. I'll show you the way. <laughs> Remove the British. Yeah, no, Malarkey's pretty fucking good. I suppose good. you don't remember me. I worked with your father. You had me committed to. I used to look after. Sorry? What for? What? When you were little. I'm sorry. It was. It was a long time ago. Oh, it's okay. I really don't I'm like her character. She's just so much mm, mild and meek and boring. Anyway, I'm. I'm sorry for existing. Sorry. Mm -hmm. I, I'm so sorry. I apologize. May I go in there? Is is it okay? Can I? May I breathe the oxygen in this room? Mr. Steinbeck, the night manager, will be downstairs if you need anything. Oh, I mean, I, and ironically, Alyssa, I miss the don't nod, like snark, you know, because Chloe would actually be fun to play in this movie. Like if, if she was Chloe. And just let those fucking corny one-liners. Oh, Dad, you look hella good. Feast. What is there? Fill feast fool. Click click. Boom. Open. Let's see what she packed. Are you like super weak? Open the fucking thing. Bitch. I swear to god. Is it a concrete slab? I'm sliding my mouse like half a foot there. Jeez. She's got, like, really ditzy hands. Oh, right, here we go. Can we open it? Uh, uh, yeah! Olympic weightlifter over here. Oh my god, you packed all your records. Wait, is she being committed? What is happening? Why is she... I should have listened to the cop. Did was did any of you guys pay attention? Are, are we committed or did we just have to move out of our house? Hey Sook boy. Whole whiny. Erica, you were meant to be here. Oh, she grew up here. What the fuck is the Delphi house? So, is this not a psychiatric hospital? What is going on? Uncle Lucy got you. It should keep you out of trouble. No collusion. Ew. What the fuck kind of gift is that? No wonder the girl's traumatized, what the hell? Why is it all dusty and shit? Like, this is a gift you give to someone? Look at this, it's like it, gets, it was caught in a volcanic eruption. Motherfucker, get the girl like a Barbie or something. What the hell is this? Oh my god. Is this like a symbolism for how she has to guard her youth and virginity under lock and key? 
in a dusty old tower that represents like the patriarchy or something. What is it? Are they really just psychiatrically fucking with her? Oh, cool. They branded it. She's just like you. They let her pick a tattoo. They let a child have a tattoo. Yeah, for real, just get her a Nintendo Switch, not creepy dolls. <laughs> At least you'd have something to play with in their new psych room, other than the goddamn record player. I hate when movies do that. Did you guys know there's a very little known fact, but guns do not actually click when you aim them. They don't make rattly clickety clack sounds when you move them around. If they do, you need to fix them. <laughs> oh no, did you wake up pregnant? What's the matter, sweetheart? Feeling fat today? <gasps> You're hemorrhaging. That's actually a bad sign. Your organs are failing. <laughs> or you like punched yourself in your sleep. You can cock the gun up and make a click, but like every single movie is the guy literally just holds it and aims it and it's like click, it. click, 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 click. Stop being rude to me, I'm mentally ill. <laughs> Why is she so fixated on the girl? If this is a psychiatric hospital, it's very high end. This is some rich people shit. What? Confront. Oh, what? Give me one. Can I have one? Fuck you. No. I smuggled this in here in my Over. own butthole. Over here. Death wish. Don't mind her, she's got emotional problems. Hurry up and die, Hannah. I'm doing my best. She seems nice. Yeah. It's how I banter with my friends. But it's not her fault. I blame society. Uh, we live in a society. Here. Take a seat, let me show you something. Oh my god, I wanted to smoke, not a fucking piano lesson. See this bit? It's simple. Four notes. And? What, did I sign up for music lessons? Who the fuck? Oh my god. God, this is like the worst, this is my nightmare. Somebody did this to me. Okay, there. Well, they really don't use this now, do they? Okay. Do I have to play it right? I didn't- I wasn't even listening. There. I'll do the rest. Unreal. Oh, fuck. Let me out of here. The smoker chick was right, kill yourself. Oh wow, thank you. That was fast. Ew. Oh, <laughs> God damn, that is some rapid suicide. 
What are you doing? Here we fucking go. No, 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 no cleaning! No cleaning without supervision! Percy! Oh my god. It's got nothing She's like to super retarded. Fuck off. She's bleeding. No, no, no. Don't, no, don't you, you dare. It's not loud. Kirsty, no, no, calm no, no, down. No, no, no. Calm down. Uh oh, she's having an autistic episode. Get off! Get off! Oh, it's like my nephew. When you tell him you can't have chocolate for dinner. She's innocent. Stop struggling. <laughs> Stop resisting arrest. <laughs> Put your knee on her neck. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit, they're injecting her with fentanyl. They're gonna frame her. <laughs> Put a fake $20 bill in her pocket, too. <laughs> Make it look realistic. <laughs> hey, Connor. Erica Mason. You look just like your mother. Last time we met, you could barely see over the desk. Oh my god, thank you. Everybody has to remind me I have to fucking... This place up with your father. I grew up here. He gave me a doll when I was little. <laughs> I hope it was the right one. Did you sleep okay? I know the old place can take a bit of getting used to. Again, with the audio dip, like, it's so... All right. Uh, nightmares. I, um, don't really get much sleep. I have nightmares. Speak up. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that. Enunciate. Dr. Ballard heads up our Stop own whining. department. She might be able to help you. As you guys can tell, I probably wouldn't make a great counselor. I hope you don't mind, but I brought you something. It's a butt plug. The quintessential diamond heart butt plug. It was your father's. Your mother gave it to him on their wedding day. Oh, God damn it! Right, the fuck's... Why are you giving suicidal chick a zippo? Or really anything she can hurt herself with? Come on, you motherfucker. just... kept hold of it. Hey. Sorry about that. Yeah, I hate her I face too. I hate everything it. about her. It's not like she's she doesn't have an ugly face or anything. It's just the attitude, Erica, the perma pelt. Like whoever killed is so aggravating. Killed Mr. Johar. There may be some other victims as well that we don't know about. Help, is there get me out of here. Anything I can do to help? Honestly, we don't have much to go on. But Mr. Flowers has a suggestion. It might help you remember the face of your father's killer. Sure. I get flashes. Um, nightmares. Uh, a silhouette, a woman with a gun, but that's it. Let's get some uh, French in here, maybe. C'est tout. C'est comme une thérapie. Elle a été développée par ton père. Elle pourrait te soulager de tes cauchemars. Hon hon. C'est 100% à dolor. D'accord. S'il vous plaît. Merci beaucoup. D'accord, je vais le faire. Even in a different language, she's still whining so. Vous allez voir son consul pour vous relaxer. Uh oh, she's got about, about to have her brain dilated. Let's try. Let me hear some German. Dein Vater entwarf die Regressionstherapie, um unseren Traumapatienten zu helfen. Das erste Bild ist ein Test. Sag mir einfach das erste, was dir einfällt. Not good. Uh, first thing, Sky. Let's go back to English. Fuck Sky. It. How can it not have Japanese? Okay. I was hoping for a heavy rain moment, but... If you remember but... anything important, mm. just write it down. I know revisiting trauma can be difficult. That's all she does. She doesn't. Re she doesn't visit trauma because she never leaves trauma. All she does is revel in it like a pig in mud. She lives trauma. Let's begin. 
um, nature. nature. Faith, guilt, peace, cult. Faith. Faith. Aw. What? Where's the adorable option? Farm, I Farm. guess. What the hell? Like, the game is like, what's the first thing that comes to your mind? And I, I'm... For me, it's like, aw, baby goat. And then the first option I see is fucking slaughter. Um... Mask. <gasps> Weapon. Stab. 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 Kill. Kill. Aw, cute. Penny. They're not gonna show me a dead animal, are they? Motherfuckers, I swear to God. Don't do it. Don't do it. Don't fucking do it. I literally had to turn the volume down to minimum. This is what I mean. This is what I fucking hate with Hollywood mixed movies, is having to write the volume. It's you, Erica. It's always been you. What am I supposed to fist you? What do you want? Ew. That's what I thought too, Wolfie. He looks exactly like the fucker in Dark. Hang on, let's check. I, I don't think so. There's no way. But, um... Show me my screen, asshole. Give me a... What? Ah. I can never make my taskbar appear when I'm, like, full screened. Close that. Damn it. Uh, what's this guy's name? Oh god, oh no, wrong screen. I'm doxing all of you, all of your usernames to yourselves. Okay, that's better. Dark cast. Man, I need to rewatch that show. That, that was a fun show, but... Oh fuck, it doesn't have photos. Wait, it does. I know it was a cheating dad. And the show is just fucking impossible to get it. Uh, give me a, give me Google. Was it him? Yeah, it was Ulrich. Yeah, but it's not him, is it? Keep in mind, I have severe autistic facial blindness, so I have no idea, but I don't think it's him. I don't think so, this guy has mad cheekbones and shit. I guess we'll see. What the hell did you do to me? It's okay. You, you were drawing. That's him? No, you were drawing the whole time. The guy who cheats, so. Uh... Oh, he did play Hitler, didn't he? It's something. Try drawing something. Gee, I wonder what she's gonna draw. Ew. The father Zachary is Brian F. Moldy. Yeah, okay. So not the same guy. Why did you draw your mother? <laughs> I mean, why not? What else is she supposed to? Light it. Your mother told me this place was her whole life. She worked here, fell in love here, had you here. Later, she died here. Yeah, thanks. Dr. Ballard suggested so much for not reliving trauma. This. You guys are awesome at this. Hey, can we fuck? We don't want you, you know, we don't want to rip open old wounds or anything, but can we fuck with your brain and make you see psycho hallucinations, like scary horror, creepy, creepo stuff, and also, can you draw your dead mom for us? She died here, you know. Killed herself, in fact. It was fucked up. 
It's a process, Erica. It takes time. I don't ever want to do that again. Hello, Smoke. Welcome to the club. I know it's frustrating. Maybe when you've had a chance to rest, you'll change your mind. Come on. Bye, hydrated man. Something I want to show you. We'll need this. Oh, great. Hey, we need you to cut your own finger off, if that's okay. Oh, look how shitty that flower is rotoscoped. It was worse just a second when they didn't have the blur on it, but... Oh, it's so piss poorly cut out. It doesn't even move with the window or anything. <laughs> to be fair, though, like, I know we're all gonna be shitting on this game throughout, but... In the game's defense, it's like eight bucks, you know? Like for, for the price for what it is, it's like it's fine. This isn't some uh sixty dollar triple A thing. I think a bunch of like indie guys your literally just made this by themselves. In your mother's memory. They were her favorite. They've always brought his luck. Oh no. She's at it again. Oh, wait, that's a smoker. Sorry. Sometimes the girls have difficult days. But some of us like to keep it buried deep down inside. Yeah, Anna, deep down in a pad. I didn't think you'd be up. Is this that is sexist? Erica Mason. She'll be staying with us for a while. Well, didn't I bleed all over you this morning? I'm taking these to Doc Ballard. We're making perfume. Do you want to come? Uh, Fuck off! What is wrong with you? Ah, oh, the audio levels. I might slap a compressor on this myself. Go hang out with Toby. Actually, they're about to serve lunch. It's quite a spread. Why don't you go and grab yourself a bite and maybe meet some No, I want to check on the fat one. Sure. Oh, wait. Or should I good old soggy sandwich make in the perfume? Company of strangers? No, that sounds awfully boring. She's having a funnier fit, but maybe you can make Christine have a hissy fit again. Stab. Oh. No, not the cake. They're watching. Have the fruit. They're giving these lunatics gigantic like knives. The what the fuck? If I if I was supervising these people, what do you mean? They'd be playing plastic. They're watching. They'd be getting little baby cutlery. They're always watching. They want to know if we can see what they're hiding. Aren't you hungry? Yeah, I want a cake, bitch. Then you, you yelled have at to me. Eat. If you don't eat, you'll waste away. And we have work to do. You. <laughs> she thinks she's being gang stalked, yeah. <laughs> you missed a spot. Here. They're making them clean their own torture devices. Like here, I see there's still some uh, coagulated blood on here from earlier when you were bleeding out your nose. What did you mean at lunch when you said they were hiding something? Oh yeah, just the pink stuff. It's pretty, but if you drink it, you'll get sick. What? Uh oh, she is being gang stalked. Jam the door. Okay, so, but you know, these super high tech, uh, fucking insane asylum people, they definitely don't have a. Your room bugged? What do you mean, unblock? I feel like if we jam ourselves in here with her, they, we, she's gonna rape us. She's gonna super mega molest us. in here but they'll come they always do all right i'm anxious i don't think we should be in here you can't help them i don't want to see the animals again uh, what? i swear to god this movie better not show me any dead animals at any point it'll upset me good or they'll hurt him who's him Shh. you know 
know you're not supposed to have the door closed. It's okay. The mop fell, but I fixed it. Erica was helping. Were you having a lesbian moment? That's all he wants to know. Look under the pillow. Fuck our shit. What are you doing, you lunatic? What are you doing? Sometimes they come at night. Oh, she's fucking I'm sleeping, crazy. But I know. Look under the pillow. And a little tape. I, I see she operates by a Resident Evil rules where a little dinky duct tape can keep a fucking door closed. Oh, look. She also happens to make psycho drawings. What a surprise. Aw. Never mind, actually. That's a nice one. I mean, she draws like a retarded four year old, but. I mean, that's kind of what she. God damn it, it's gonna be dead animals. I can tell. I can fucking tell the next page is gonna be a dead animal. Watch. It's gonna be the fucking thing decapitated. Come on. Throw me a curveball. Prove me wrong. No dead animals. Oh, thank God. Wow. I like the rabbits best. Okay, thank you. They're I appreciate favorite. that. I literally thought it was gonna go down the classic horror movie trope of like turns page and there's a decapitated cat. What are you doing? The fuck are you, bitch? <laughs> you scared the crap out of me. It's from Doc Ballard. A little housewarming present. Perfume. Okay. Thank you. Why were you putting no it under my bed? It's nice to have a new face around. All done. You just turn the dial and you're good to go. Dial? What kind of perfume needs a dial? Okay. Oh, is it one of those automatic spray things? Let's be super naive and turn on pheromones. Stop pouting. Uh oh. What if it's meth? The fuck? Looks like those fancy artsy scenes they make in Breaking Bad when they're cooking the blue stuff. It's a cult. Is this where they're leading us to? Where the whole Jeez, psychiatric finally. crew is part of a cult, oh, sacrificing these dummies? And it looks expensive. Do you not lock your door, bitch? What the hell kind of packaging is that? Oh no, is it gonna be another doll? Erica got a present. It's a big one. Oh, please be ahead. Pretty. Open it. Yeah, open it. Go. I'm. I'm clicking. I'm trying. There. Furry card. Yeah, fucking doll. Jesus God damn it. Is hideous. Be careful. God, it really is. But it's extending a hand in a in peace. Oh, there's a oh, there's smidgens of blood. Motherfucker, like, this bitch is getting sent literal murder trophies from... Oh, her name is Anna. She's getting sent murder trophies from a serial killer and the cops don't screen her packages? Or her mail? Hey, stand back. Give it space. Oh, hey, sweetheart, you have more mail. 
I, you know, we know the last mail we received was a literal severed hand, but hey, this one might be nice. There you go. Don't worry, it's probably not a bomb. What happened? Is that from, from her dad? Oh, it's a receptionist. <gasps> Uh-oh. Da, da, da. The cult sacrificed them for getting caught. Box was mailed yesterday. They're still trying to get a description of the sender. Description of the sender. Yeah. Take a look at this. That's Carl Steinbeck's place. The night manager. Mm-hmm. I've met him. What about him? Got a team there now. He's missing. Is he dead? There's no body. But it doesn't look good. Yeah, you don't usually mail people your skin. Yeah, why are they it's handing her evidence? Like, why does the... Why is she looped dead. in... Like, why are they keeping her official. in the loop? She's a child. Who gives a shit? It's the same tattoo. This is a police investigation. They're like, here's all the evidence we have so this? far. What do you think? What should we do? Why send the doll? Do you have any advice? Like, motherfucker, she's just a traumatized bitch. With, like, the sads. Who needs a fucking Prozac prescription? And Actually, no. She needs, she needs fucking uppers. Uh, Birthmark? There's a mark on the arm. A butterfly, it's the same as this. It's not a birthmark. That's supposed to be a birthmark? Sure. Ah, uh, both. El Savario. He's very, very fun. smart and he's a very he's into electronics and electronic sure engineering. Else missing. But he'll screech like a little sped if you deny clothes. him his dinner. His uh, dessert, sorry. Looks like he might be here for a while. Fucking volume. You okay then? No, people keep sending me body parts. It's like the worst version of getting a dick pic from a man. Oh, nice work guarding the place, you fucking dummies. Thanks. Check if the neighbors saw anything. I like how they left the lamp on. Yes, I'm sure our alcoholic, druggy neighbor is gonna be very helpful. She'll be a great eyewitness. Yeah, for real, don't leave her. What the fuck? That cop is such an asshole. It's a good point. You're gonna leave her in the middle of a crime scene that's been ransacked by a lunatic alone again? Last time you left her alone, that person ended up fucking dying and having his skin mailed. Well, she was a cunt to us, so I hope Police. she's dead. Fuck her. Open the door, or the door will be forced open. The door is about to be forced open. Oh no, you guys, he has his baton out. Oh, you might. Do we have a license for that? <laughs> Where's your baton license? <laughs> They're chasing a fucking serial killer lunatic. And he has a little stick for self defense. I think the cop did it. We'll see, I guess. Maybe. Maybe they're pulling a heavy rain on us. Hey, 
Where is she? I hope she's dead. Wait, is she the insane? Maybe she's the lunatic. Hey, Genic. What if the dad was just applying makeup to his chest and he's the killer? goodness. That's not the girl. Where'd the cop go? Call, call him for help. Be like, hey, here. Over here. Mr. Sir. Cop guy. What did you expect? Uh, ah, piece of paper. Wait. The music is very odd right now. Ah. Oh, this is the night guard. Okay, I couldn't tell. Gotta look black for some reason. First thing she does is mess up the crime scene for real and contaminate the dead body. Oh, that was very natural. Hey, Erica, how come your DNA and fingerprints are all over the corpse? Don't look, she basically had sex with him. Fuck's sake. The evidence is all worthless now. I like Hannah. She's funny and kind. God. She must have been bad. Ah! She's this sick. is so finicky. The hell? I don't mean that only bad people get sick. Oh my god, what the fuck? Just sick like that. No, it doesn't do like it. Like Hannah. Hannah is sick. I hope she gets better. But you should sign a card just in case. The last one didn't get better. She was Toby's friend. <laughs> she used to draw a lot, even though she was really uh. strange. <laughs> they caught her looking for ghosts down in the basement. No, what? Guess that's pretty bad. So, why can I not make longer lines? Damn it. Whatever. Okay. No, hey! The judgment. <laughs> they take you away and show you the animals. <laughs> then My daddy told me about it. I was trying to. Come on, I, I wanted I to put a bad. very realistic ball sack you know, in there I with the wrinkles and everything. And also, like, the sign it with "kill yourself." That's how I know. See. Oh no, are you telling me that somebody ripped tape? Ah, oh, but they need a knife for that. That's what Resident Evil has taught me. Maybe even a chainsaw. She does, Kaiser, you're right. I, like something about it, he, she does look like a big mouth character. I don't know why. I think it's the eyes somehow. Oh, this fucking shit. Oh my god, she's being framed. If oh, never mind. You've seen it, they'll take you away and make you forget. What? How dark can a closet be that a fucking lighter would help illuminate it? Bet you have a secret, like, rape dungeon bunker door in your closet. You're sus. You're the sussy you bunker. can't get inside. You haven't got a key. No cap? Fuck you. Fuck the police. Jefferson. 
I wonder what that password is gonna be for. Taking out of some sort of operation. Uh, normal. We are a uh, super sad, bummed out, super pouty, hey, Debbie Downer, wet blanket, stick in the mud, bitch. Hannah's gone. Who just I'm constantly bad. whines and um. Yeah, it's pretty much a story. Oh, and I think our dad was murdered, and we're trying to find out who some did it. Books. Strange dreams. The big battle's fully below. Yeah, we all do, bitch. That's why you're here. Toby, you're bleeding. She's always bleeding. Oh no, wait, that's a black chick. Oh no, it's contagious. What? What is a hug gonna do? Give her a napkin. You're gonna got blood all over your shoulder. Hey, Riptorev. We're just gonna go over some of the evidence. From Isn't sticking the mud an insult towards to gay people? No. What? Since when? There's no need to worry. The chief inspector asked that we do it here. I guess I could be thinking about it. That's kind of funny. Uh, it's no use. No. No, the station. Not the station. Why aren't we doing it at the police station? Yeah, why? You've been through enough, Eric. Uh, we just want you to be as comfortable as possible. They'll like take her to I don't know Starbucks or something. Come on, then. A nice yeah, public well. place with cheery people, like normal people who aren't super depressed, who aren't at imminent just danger of getting nosebleeds. Instead of this, yet another rape house. Are we close? Oh my god. Ew. Is that her? <laughs> uh, something's missing? I don't know. No, something's missing. Okay. What about this? We found it in her apartment. Her name is Mia Green. Okay. Did you need a magnifying glass for that? Delphi house. She was very close to your mother. She was very protective of her. If this game had a sometimes <laughs> aggressive, if this movie had a good story, this could actually be kind of fun. What was wrong with her? Like the from a, she was I guess not a technical standpoint or a game. It, it just like. Her childhood was extremely unpleasant. Your mother's We're all basically just watching a movie right now. This is movie night, except we make to get we get to make some choices, which is fine. I like that, but it just the movie itself is so boring. Mia Green broke into the dispensary. It's just really shitty story. I mean you could even take the story or the premise and make it interesting, but just like the characters and the acting and everything is just so unengaging. You're lying. I'm afraid not. We are investigating the possibility that there's been some mistake. We've filed an order with the judge to exhume the body. And until then, I'm gonna have to keep you at Delphi House. Do you need some help? No, no, I've got it. Blake, would you mind? They got room service and everything. Residence. Yes. This is Sergeant Blake. Like Rockstar right games nowadays. I still must go. I hope GTA is house. Doesn't Come take five you. years to release. Not you. It's not safe. Fuck you. Insist. I'm going. No, Erica. He's right. There's nothing you can do. Why is it even up okay. to the 16 year old? Google. Why is this even a debate? It's like, hey, 911, what's your emergency? I'm being super mega molested and also someone's trying to kill me. Okay, we're on our way, sir, slash ma'am. And the little kid in the corner is like, oh, I'm coming along. It's not a fucking joyride. Fuck off. It's, they, they, this isn't a fucking high st a school trip. What are you doing? Go home. I'll look after her. Send her to a room. Ground her. 
This isn't a debate. Nothing sooner than the whole. Can't miss it. Yeah, something about him is creepy. I wonder. I don't know why I said it like that. Wonder. You didn't miss a whole lot. We're a, we're a depressed girl who's trying to figure out who killed her daddy. Oh, and this guy, I guess. Jesus Christ, that was a lot of. That was very quick. How long did it take her to clear up a fucking nosebleed? The guy had time to kill this guy and carve a fucking thing in his chest. Oh, you're alive? Quick, tell us. Tell us who it was. Where is it? Okay, does, does it have the killer's name? Take it. He had time to draw? Oh. Oh! <gasps> da, da, da! It's the chubby chick! She's killing everyone to cleanse them. I guess. Yeah, once again, don't call out for help or anything. Be completely still. Oh, damn it. I thought I could get... To, I, I got to draw again. <gasps> Wait, what? Oh, it's just... What? The chubby girl is his daughter? Is that the point? AJ. Is he in on the cult? I really cannot tell. Is he just another member they had to get rid of? Stop fucking with evidence. Oh, great. Hey, that's our neighbor, isn't it? Disbelief. You're dead. Not yet. Not like the chief inspector or the others. Steinbeck, Joha. They were in it together. Joker. I'd never hurt you. The wire pointing a gun at me. Desperation, fear, contempt. I hate you. Faith, show some emotion. Show anger. He's oh my god, even when she's like angry, I, I picked anger to, to like see if the actress is capable of conveying anything other than complete fucking sadness on her face, but she's not. Flesh and blood. I'm here to protect you. I'm here to protect you. <laughs> Aiming directly at your forehead. <laughs> You've ruined my life. Your father made me a monster. He took your mother and locked her away. Literally, who are you? He sold his soul to the devil and she was the price. There's another world beneath Delthy House. Secret passages and hidden doors to get you there. Yeah, no shit, I found I the doors. The medallion, the key to everything. But you gave it away. Gave it away. Oh. But there's another. It's right there in front of you. Can we talk someplace that is not a crime scene? I don't want to get caught. The locks are in the walls. Find one and see for yourself. I feel like they filmed this independently of the closet scene, maybe. Out in the woods, 
between here and Delphi House. I'll wait for you there. Okay, I get it. Come alone. I'm, I may not have a choice. I mean, when this many fucking people die, especially a cop. And I think that guy was a cop. Like, I mean, is it not time to call in, like, I don't know, a SWAT team or something? Like, more than one detective? I like how this extremely high-profile case of a very prolific and efficient and shadowy serial killer has apparently been assigned to one guy. Like, hey, Jeff, anything on your desk today? Anything on your plate? Or do you have, like, time? Oh, sir, I don't know, man. You know, my wife just had a kid. I kind of, I need to go home early. Uh, you know, I, I wish I could let you go, Jeff, but we have this serial killer who's killed 30 people a day. Could you check that out before you go home? Oh, fine. Motherfucker, assign a task force. Are you okay? Where'd you go? Toby Newman. She's got a history. She Literally listen. thought this was a movie on TV. The graphics are nuts. I know, they used Unreal Engine for this. Like, this is- they finally used the meta-human shit. Apparently it's like a beta test for the- Not a beta test, but I guess they got early access to the meta-human stuff. The fuck are sleeper games? You mean like super boring games? I don't know. There's this... Most games. <laughs> we can try Bio Mutants after this, if this isn't too long. Are you okay? Is there anything You're I can right. do? Are you kidding? Yeah, call the cops. Sorry. Call your police department. Let's try and get some sleep. You'll be safe here, I promise you. Um, don't feel safe, duh. Just don't feel safe here. Duh. It's okay. Duh. No, it's not okay. Get her a bodyguard. Everybody's ending up dead connected to this. Get the game crashed. Oh, well, that is just fucking. That is fucking A. Fucker. Continue. Better have saved cocksucker. It's literally just an MP4 file. Thank you. It's okay. Just try and get some sleep. The podcast episode was a banger. By the way, I left a five star review. Thank you, I Bob. I three Bob. Are you sure she didn't say anything? Might read anything your uh, I could help us find her. review on the next one. <laughs> Nothing. The graphics were too much. How do you make a game like this even crash? How is that even possible? You're literally just playing me MP4 files. This is VLC player with like one or two added functions for the mouse so that I can click stuff. Must be all the advanced ray tracing. Serious ruptures for what I'm doing here. This is my life's work. Do you understand that? Yeah, what exactly are you doing here, Ballard? It's not for you to know. <laughs> that doesn't seem like anything's for me to know at the moment. You just do your job and concentrate on looking after Erica in a proper fashion. A proper fashion. That's all I'm going to say to you. In a proper fashion? I mean, it's not like he's been hitting on me or something. He isn't doing anything, like, unethical. He's just extremely incompetent. <laughs> yeah, hydraulic guy. So I, I think it's gonna turn out to be a culty experimental thing. It's basically, um... Not basically, but what was that, um... Game we played a while back, that horror game. Outlast? Yeah. Like the shrink facility itself is conducting unethical experiments for Jesus or something. Wait, is, is, is it this the Tubby Girl's room? Where's she? 
Does she not care that we're in a room right now? She's sleeping right in the bed next to us. That is the key? How's that a key? What are you doing? Your mom. Confide. I found a key. A key to the hidden place. Doesn't matter. The key could have been He's anything. Dead. You could have fucking used the, like, coin. Or anything to wedge it in there. My daddy's dead. Why would I have to apologize? Fuck him. And I didn't know. I, I couldn't stop it. He's dead. Yeah, I know. He's dead and I have nowhere else to go. Yeah, you do. You could, you could go to the crime scene and clean it. There's so what much. There's They're people eating cake at the crime scene. They're going scene. to make me bleed. They're going to make me forget him. Uh, abandon, <laughs> reassure. Reassure. I won't let them take you. Whatever's happening here, I'll stop it. <laughs> Thank you, Wolfie. <laughs> They'll never let you go. I know I'm quite eloquent. Reassure. I promise. Wait, no, that doesn't mean I committed to staying with her, did it? I, I want to go to Narnia. Okay, thank you. Alright, cool. Alright, thank you, Hydraulic Mech. Where are the ten other mon- monthers? Oh, other ten monthers. I misread it as ten mothers. Ten months, holy shit. We're coming up on the anniversary, you guys. That time when you have to replay Life is Strange 1, the OG, the original. Does she not want to come with us? She's been ranting and raving about this place for so long, she's not curious? Oh, those are some cool LED lights. Gamer room. So they have like double mirrors in all these rooms, and they just watch the girls undress and shit. I wanna check out the gamer room more. No, don't go in, you lunatic. There was somebody in there! <gasps> God, that actually creeped me out, I thought there was a person hiding in the shadows. Uh, hydraulic mech, maybe? I don't know what order I played them in when I first made the Twitch. That was way back when I first moved into uh, this apartment too, so I didn't even have a setup or anything. I didn't even know how to stream yet. That was the first time I ever streamed. I think I was on the couch. <laughs> ah, a heart. Or brain. I cannot tell, it's too smushy. One second, but great idea leaving your fingerprints all over this rape dungeon murder basement. Yeah, yeah, touch all the handles. No, don't, uh, don't worry, touch the glass too. How the fuck does he not see us? This room. Garlic says, I think the sequel is more fun in a stupid way than the second one. The sequel? Than the second one. Are you talking about Before the Storm? I mean, the second one is a sequel, technically, too. The second one is a prequel, I guess. No, wait. Yeah, Before the Storm is a prequel. The second one is a sequel. I like them all. Like, original OG, Life is Strange, the series is fun. Like, it's so fun bad. The spin-offs are goddamn awful. They're not even, f uh, fun to make fun of, but... I'm gonna slap a compressor on this movie. This is so annoying now. Hold up. Eric. 
Erica. Erica! Go, crawl in the vent, just like Outlast. Run away from the monster. Twenty-four hour stream? Why would we have to twenty-four hour stream? I assume that the third one is gonna be the same length as all the others, which is to say like an hour or two for each chapter. I might for that one. I don't know. I don't want to promise. I don't want to commit to anything. I am tempted to do it all in one stream, but at the same time, I know I'm gonna get so sleepy and tired that it might not be fun. Like, life is strange. I don't know. I, I want to be all up and energetic for every single episode of that fucking thing. I'm so excited. I actually am so fucking excited for that game. More than any other game. Ugh. I wish they'd sent me a review copy. Do you guys think maybe we could, like, trick them into sending us a review copy? Like, I could email them and you guys could email them like, Hey, my favorite streamer, Kai Orsa, he's a Turkish LGBTQIA+. Mental health streamer, and he loves Don't Not. He's played and streamed every single one of you guys' games, and I really want to see him re review it. Could you guys send him a review copy? Yeah, you guys are down. <laughs> Let's like uh, organize. I'll try. I'll try to um, compose an email to them this week, and I'll let you guys know, and you can like run this organized astroturfed campaign of trying to get me a <laughs> review copy. What's their email? Wait, hang on. Let's see. Do I still have my... Ugh, motherfucker. Uh, Don't nod. Ah, I love this company. Remember, you cannot tell them that I actually just make fun of their fucking games. You played one of our games and you would like to share your experience with us. You're a professional press influencer. You're a game development studio. Oh, no, no, no. Don't open my emails. Jesus, not on stream. Cancel. Okay. But it's a... Uh, it's pro at don't dash not. Okay, that's the one I would have to mail, I guess. Yeah, I guess you guys would have to use this one, which is contact at don't not dash, you know, copy. This. Should I just call the CEO? <laughs> I wish they had a phone number. Jareh Fouze. Hey. You could also, uh, I guess, travel to Paris and protest in front of their office. Maybe chain yourselves to their building. <laughs> Do the whole uh, Extinction Rebellion shit. The only hope we have is they don't type my name into YouTube to watch me play it. Oh, they are cooking meth. I think it's a perfume, so I think it's gonna be something with the flowers. What do you guys think? I think the flowers have like a psychedelic drug in it. Or substance. And the perfume they make out of them turns people fucking loco. Hopefully they don't fight your gods. <laughs> No, don't hurt animals. No. They seek visions of the Please just let it be stupid furries and, power. and costumes, not actual animals being hurt. But they cannot see without a butterfly. That's okay. 
I think of. Uh, oh, are we like the main goddess of this or something? Bye, Adel. She's trapped, Erica. Don't not aren't developing the new one, Deck Nine are. Join me. Wait, Deck Nine, I, I'm. Who the fuck is Deck Nine? Actually, I, I know, I know who they are, but I always forget Deck Nine. But they are basically don't not are they not? Um, games developed. Ratchet. What? They haven't even done. Oh, before the storm. Uh, before the storm was respectively, respectably cringe. Still, you guys. I don't worry. We're still gonna get our cringe. Before the storm is bona fide, awful and cringe and funny still. But you know what? Let's um. What's really important is first of all. Stop scorching our eyeballs. True colors. Let's look up the writers. Felice Kwan. Felice Kwan. Uh, maybe we can look up okay, Life is Strange 2. Life is Strange series. Games, games, games. Life is Strange. Where's the first one? Sean Lucena. Ah, Phyllis didn't write that one. No. Oh, no, it's not even the original writers. That's two different, uh, completely different guys. Christian Devine and Jean Lucena. And this is by Phyllis Kwan. Ah. Ah. Mm, Kaya is sad. Now I feel like the girl in the movie. I'm so sad all the time. Oh shit, you know, I'm gonna give it a chance. I don't know. I, like I said, before the storm was still very respectively, respectably um, awful. What the fuck? He wasn't even the writer on this. Is this guy entirely new? He hasn't written any of the Don't Not games. Oh no. What if he wrote Tell Me Why? Hold up, let's just let's vet this man. Let's gather some docs. What the fuck is all this? Video game. Obviously the only thing anybody cares. Okay, he's not the writer for Tell Me Why, that's a good sign. Then hell, who the hell is Felice? Fel is this them? Felice Chehuei Kwan? Oh yeah, it is. Wait, so he was a writer on Tell Me uh, on Before the Storm, but Wikipedia doesn't list him or her. Um, man, I'm confused now. Okay. Well, in that case, still, I, I guess we'll be, uh, we can expect good things. Don't give up hope, yeah. Fil Jesus, what is this website? No, don't contact. Felice Chohei Kwan is a staff writer at Deck Nine Games. She lives in Boulder, Colorado, near the U.S.'s blah, blah, blah. That's it. Yeah, all right. I'll I'll be an optimist and say that I'll still be wowed. Together we can save her. Save her. Together we can set her free. Oh. Sure, why not? Fuck it. Show me how. Go ahead. Mother Miranda. <laughs> it's you, Erica. What? You're not sacrificing me. Fuck you. 
It's always been you. What movie is that from? That's like a meme, isn't it? It's you, it's always been you. <laughs> Ah, having a future. memory moment. Wonderful it's always been here. That only she could see. I'd tell her about the past. About a great priestess. Marked with a butterfly. Why did you bring me here? Because this is where it all began. Fucking more perfume. Your father made it. He tested on your mother. Ah, I know it. The perfume he is the. You too. Ah, drives people crazy. Leave it in, and I can make you do anything. Snort it. It's how he brainwashed us and made us his slaves. Ah, oh, this motherfucker. He made mind control perfume for women. How deviant! Not even. It's not a. I don't know. It's not a food item. You know, it's not any substance. It's like he didn't put it in vape juice, you know? He made it a perfume so he could get attractive women into his hentai harem and mind control his waifus. And he shaped the bottle like extravagant butt plugs, too. This time we've been getting brainwashed and groomed. think of the movie scene that this reminded me of like at the end I don't know if it's a movie or TV show but the villain at the end goes like all the architects of your like demise it's it's me it's always been me <gasps> James Bond ah fuck finally okay my brain can rest Ernst Stavro Blofield in the James Bond movie Turns to Bond and says, it's always been me. It's been me, Bond. Always been me. Or something like that. Fucking finally. Oh my god, he groomed- Ew, he used a perfume on her when she was like seven? What the fuck did she- did he make her do? Oh no! He had a- he had a mind-controlled lollycon. Bite by that bacon smasher, you get trolled, bitch. I deserve to die. Play this one? No. Uh, wait, is this an old game? This came out yesterday on Steam, so maybe it was released elsewhere earlier. A girl to stare into the flames and see the future. The music is so weird. It's just so off and doesn't fit at all. How do you know about the priestess and the fire? How do you think? Oh, okay, it's old. Well, not old. That's mean. One of them. It's barely two years old. See for yourself. What did Dad use corpses and body parts for? Firewood. Lucian 
that by adding science to ritual, they could see into the future and control it. Your mother was the missing piece. Why the mother? Your mother's alive. But she's fading. Without I don't get her, it. Like, blind. Is she actually Your dead? Is she in a coma? What, what, is, what, what is she saying? Where is our mother? We can end this. And why was she killing random? We can set her free. From what? You're being so vague, black lady. Black serial killer. Security camera, bitch. Don't you play stealth games? Cut the wire. That knife! That is the worst fucking knife to cut a wire with. It's not even serrated. That's a kind of knife where if you try to cut a lemon or a a lime that was that had tough skin it would take forever keep it you may need to use it keep the wire what now we have an inventory system what is going on in there good night normal person So she's now teaching us to be a serial killer. The medallion. Yeah, da. Do we know the girl's name? Yeah, go, go. They must have sealed it. They changed the locks on a fucking cryptic. Full Resident Evil puzzle door. <laughs> they must have changed it. Oh yeah, her name is Erica. I'm fucking retarded. <laughs> I literally forgot the name of the whole ass game. Wait, wait, wait. What? What? I was looking away. How did she not come out? Rewind. Can't let him live. Back. I can't Where rewind. What? No, just tie him up. Sure, why not? Fuck it. This game took such a nose turn, uh, such a nose dive. What do you mean, show me how? It's a knife. Stab. How do? You... What kind of a question is that? Show me how to use a knife. I don't know. Aim for the heart. No, damn it! Damn it! Damn it! I missed it. Fuck. No. Is there like checkpoints? Damn it! How do you not have checkpoints in a fucking MP4 file? I mean, why not kill all of them? They'll see us. Yeah, well, last time I tried to go in there, I got caught. That's not any safer. We need to kill the lights. Her haircut annoys you. Which one's the the killer or the Erica? <coughs> Erica's haircut is normal, so I assume you mean the other one. Take me to the hidden door. We don't have much time. Wonderful, I had to click my mouse at least 17 times in the last two hours almost. This is most certainly a game, you motherfucker. And I am a pro gamer. Erica. What? Jesus, Where'd you come from? Looking everywhere. What happened? Where did you go? Oh, what a, what a great motherfucking cop you are. I know. I know you're hiding something here. Uh, where'd you go? I've been looking for you, just... Do I remember your witness protection? Duh. Oh! 
Oh yeah, that escalated quite fast. <laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> to be fair, he deserved it. He was such a fucking asshole loser. You can't take any chances. What's with the you red lighting all over the place? You have to save your you have mother. to do whatever it takes. So, we have to kill the security guard. We can't tie him up. Because reasons. We also can't just let him go because he would raise alarm. An alarm, you know, usually comes in the form of a very loud noise. Like an alarm. You know what else is a really loud noise? Just shooting a fucking pistol in the middle of a hallway <laughs> that tends to reverberate. Everywhere in the building. Everywhere. Everyone heard that gunshot. And now they know. And I'm trying to adjust my gamer light so I'm also super red. There we go. Okay. Let's fit the mood. Promise me. If you Promise. Did, I like this. I like the dark it. path. I want to be the... I want to be the new killer. I promise. I will kill for you for some reason. I'm convinced. What happened? Oh, please. What's going on? Let me kill her. All Let me kill her. All oh, the lights went off and I heard a loud ass gunshot. Damn it, game, just let me draw a dick. This game is such a cock block. D there's a corpse right there. Jesus Christ. They didn't even drag him into the bushes. Oh my god. Stay here. No matter what happens, do not leave this. Don't go back in there. I am the danger. I don't go. It'll never end. Just go, the alarm is grating. Go. Hydraulic, I still I have no idea. I don't I don't know if it's a an asylum, a hospital, or what, or hotel. Go! My poor ears. I cannot take this. Go. Go, girl, go. Thank you. I like how this, like, 15-year-old who's never, you know, hurt anybody and who couldn't hurt an ant or a fly. Like, so much as step on a cockroach. She's now all in on murder. She knows how to use a gun somehow, magically. Nobody had to show her how to uh, undo the safety or how to reload or... Cock it, it just natural born killer, I guess. Augie, I like that Augie actually thinks that this is Ellen Page or Elliot Page or whatever the fuck her name is or his her. It's... You can't be in here. Toby needs her treatment. Uh, Please, let's try explaining. What are you doing? They're looking for you. They found a body in the garden. How do you know? I think you might be unwell. Wake her. Wake her up. That's too dangerous. Right. Don't mean too it's hard, you guys. I like the copy pasta too, I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> that oh sh uh uh think of something. The copy pasta for those who don't know was born out of like, somebody just seething and coping in my chat about Resident Evil 8 because they didn't like the way I was playing and I, I finally I just I got so annoyed by it I had to call it out and that's how that copy pasta was born people making fun of the person what the hell shoot I know I shouldn't be here I just couldn't leave Toby we have to wake her up you have to take the tubes out Ew. Ah, ew. Ew. 
Oh, great work. Now she's seizing into her brain. What do you mean, to? Well, who am I? Fucking Dr. House? Incubate. I need two cc's of ML Gazafenine. Stat. We're just gonna inject her with random shit. What? What? I'm not a doctor! Okay, guy, <laughs> gang. In the event. Okay, stop memeing for like half a second. I need actual medical advice from Twitch. TV. In the event of a seizure, do you use a lidocaine or do you use epinephrine? I don't think you can use epinephrine. Wait, isn't epinephrine... Isn't that artificial... Like, um... The energy hormone, basically? Adrenaline, isn't that... Epinephrine? Yeah, epi is adrenaline. That's not what you want to give to someone who's already spazzing out, right? I feel like that would make it worse. I think, okay, let's... <laughs> essential oils. <laughs> yeah, use the perfume. Spray your face with it. Um, okay, I think I'm gonna go with lidocaine. Which, I don't... I have no idea what that is. No, you can't do that! No, aw, oh, this girl has not watched any doctor movies. Guys, when you when you have a syringe, what you have to do is you you know the You have to make sure there's no air bubbles. Come on. Have you never watched the medical drama, girly? Shing inject. That's a lot. Hey, well, we either euthanized her or we saved her. We saved her! We did a- oh. Fuck. <laughs> well, alright. <laughs> Shit. He already put an end to her. Make it stop. Please. Is there not, like, no blame? Like, why Why did you pick that specific vial of medication? Why did you inject her with exactly half a... half an ounce of liquid? Of course, this motherfucker is. He's in on it too. The Gustavo Fring of this asylum. Have you not heard the alarm or the gunshots? Are you sleeping? What's happened? It's me. <laughs> Please. Put the gun down. Nope. Getting Maybe shot in the head. The we can work it out. I promise. That's it. Just oh shoot! Where's the, I don't want to. I don't want to even interrogate him. Just fucking shoot him. Here. We can work this out. I don't care. Put him on his knees and blow his brains out. What's happening here? What are you hiding? This is a hospital. Nothing more. <laughs> Wait, default exploit says that he or she looked it up and lidocaine actually does treat seizures at lower doses. Well, maybe Erica shouldn't have injected a whole Coca-Cola can's worth of lidocaine, you know? That was probably a bad idea. The dosage matters. Uh, experiments. I know you've been taking the girls. Doing experiments. 
It's not an experiment, it's their treatment. Treatment for what? Those are sick. We help them. We make them better. Oh, you're a fucking idiot. I want to help you too. You're dangerous. No. You know. No. Well, okay, thank I you. That's kind of base. I believe you. And cool, but. I believe anything you say. You don't have to believe me. You broke she, me. She showed some emotion. You guys, pay attention to her face. For the first time in the entire movie, it's not 100% sadness and meek and mild whininess, but it's 99% sadness and 1% anger. Look. With a gun. You're pointing right She's at mildly you're upset instead of just whiny. <laughs> and we're right back to whiny. Oh, shoot him. This is the first time you felt this These are Second Amendment rights. Shoot him. I think you need help. This is America, goddammit. I know it's the UK, but I don't care. Go. Erica. Erica, don't be a cuck. I'm a killer. Blah, 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 blah. Father, it's, it's real. The... I know what I saw. I know it's real. There's something wrong with you. Okay, get to it already. Poison. Poison in your mind. Roofies. It's been there a very long time. This place of security sucks. Two little girls were able to infiltrate Please. this place. Trust me. Nope. Cue up the song for this. Uh, hang on, hang on. Where's my, where's my Firefox? Sunreal. What? Hold on, guys. Hold on. This, this is an important moment. We need, we need the correct soundtrack for this. Uh, give me a sec. Damn it, I don't think I can find it. <laughs> okay, I found it. <laughs> My head is a fantasy. No. What's behind door A? A fucking support again. There is something behind you. Oh no, it's plants. Never mind. Have I won yet? Not yet. But I think we're close. Oh, it's the furry sanctuary, I guess, with the masks. Yay. Devi, we've been going for exactly two hours. Weird that they had to fake the flames entirely.
Why is she gassing herself again? To revive her mom? You're just gonna be tripping, you're not gonna revive a dead person. Breathe in. Oh, yeah, smell that. Really? They had to fake the smoke on this? Why? They couldn't have just... Erica. Literally just put some smoke in that thing. Made it look a little real. Ah. Hello, mother. Beautiful butterfly mo mommy. Release me. Ow. Oh, none of you ex have explained what that even means. Is that the twist to this? Not twist, I guess, but... Is the end goal that a psychedelic trip where we slit our own throats and then we're free and happy and in G with Jesus and with our little butterfly mommy? Oof. Oh! waiting for us. You know I killed half your clan. Ah, we put on the mask. The BDSM mask. Let's go. Put on the shitty laced mask. Oh, that's right, bitch. Bow. Yeah, fuck yeah, except I want to be a queen. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah! Yes. A goddess in her converse and her skinny jeans. So much for dark. A new butterfly sense her madness embraced. A girl to stare into the fire and see the future. She's high. What's with the romantic Okay. <laughs> okay, I guess. That's it. I I got like 17 achievements at once, by the way. You guys cannot see the Steam interface, but I'm getting spammed with achievements. Is that it? I can't even skip this. Is there an after credits? I guess I don't care, but I can't even escape out of it. I hate the arrogance of some of these games where and movies. Well, no, actually, just games where they do not let you cancel the credits. Okay, guys, I get it. Okay, motherfucker. Like, if you don't let me get out of your credits, it's not like I'm now stuck here, forced to watch and admire all the names. Here's what's gonna fucking happen. I bring up Task Manager, and the Task Manager is fucking based in Red Pill, and he fucking puts you on your knees and he blows your brains out, and he kills your .exe file. And that's how it fucking goes. That's how the cookie crumbles, asshole. Alright. I actually finished the game on stream. Uh, other than Resident Evil, I guess. Am I gonna play Yeek? What the hell is Yeek? 
Let's check it out. The fuck is this? Running Shine Reek Review. What? Just give me a trailer. Postmodern RPG. Ah, oh, fuck you. I am awake. I am one. East Brit Games. You say to me, I am only a mercy. Blah, 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 blah. Do we play a Redditor? Yeah, I don't want to play this. I don't want to be reading dialogue. I also don't want to be playing a Redditor who apparently breaks into places to creep on people. Yeah. Oh, there is dubbing. Ah, that just seems annoying to play. So is Bayou Mutants funny to play? Is that worth checking out for us, or should we just watch some darn man? I'll leave it up to you guys. I'll make a quick poll. And go pee. so bad. Uh, here, have some music. While. I take a little bathroom break and I'll be right back. I'm back. Let's see what you guys decided. Wait, where'd my poll go? Darman. Barely won. Okay. Ah, oh man, Darman. Fucking Darman. It's always such a pain. Wonder 
Gamer says, Darman sucks. Yes, he does. Well, we could watch, like, I don't know, two or three, and then maybe we can play Bio Mutant if I'm not too sleepy by then. Wait, are you leaving, Hannah? Student with Down Syndrome gets shamed. I think we watched that one. Sister calls brother's goal a gold digger. Businessman threatens Asian owner. <laughs> spoiled girl demands car for birthday. Mean girl fat shames plus size dancer. Spoiled teen X like own she owns the world. Teenager fat shamed. This kid gets humiliated playing ball. Spoiled son doesn't want to do chores. We've seen that one. Mean girl humiliates bald girl. Single mom shamed by soccer mom. Poor student shamed by... Jeez, my, my eyes shifted slightly and can you keep the titles apart? They all sound the same. Poor student shamed for old clothes. Almost man gets his... Oh, I don't want to watch that. That'll make me sad. Oh, we watched this one. That was fun. Teacher accused a son, student of doing drugs. Okay, let's start with business threatens Asian woman. Hi, are you guys open? I'd like to get a mani petty. Yes, welcome. You're actually our very first customer. Oh, great. I'm really excited about this place. I've been going to Sal Salon, but they Are you? The you sound like a Karen. I don't know about that. No lines here. Uh, just go on back and Connie can help you. Great. Thank you so much. Hi, come over here, please. Good morning, sir. Can I help you? Yeah. By closing your shop and getting out of town. Damn. I'm sorry. Hi. Are you taking any walk-ins? Oh, yes, of course. You know, you really shouldn't be supporting foreigners, hon. And neither should you. <laughs> I'm so sorry. Uh, go on back and... Uh, Kim, can you please help her? Of course. Right this way, please. Is everything okay? Everything's fine, honey. You can go back to what you're doing. Oh. <gasps> Why don't we go outside? Yeah. Oh, uh, yeah, let's take this outside. I don't understand where this is coming what, from. Why is there random flex sticking wrong. out of the wall? What's here? wrong is you and your people coming into this country? Look at that. Look. Just a random little tiny party flag stuck in a little crevice in the wall. We're not trying to start a competition with you, if that's what you're worried about. We're just trying to run our business. You think that you can compete with me? Look, that's my salon over there, all right? I got people waiting in line all day long. I'm not worried about some foreigner trying to compete with me. That's right, okay. foreigner. Then what's the issue? The issue is you being in this country. You're not welcome here. This is so they need to get out. Hey, boss. Uh, one of the registers isn't working. Can you come help out? Yeah, I'll be there in a minute. Ah, the fucking Asians. They fucked it up again. You lucked out today, sport. Because next time, I'm not going to be so nice. Oh, <gasps> Recorded. TikTok him. Shame him. Dox what him. Maybe back? Maybe we should just move. Maybe we should just move because of one heckler. That we just open? Yeah, what the fuck, Absolutely dummy? not. Oh. I like the subtle racism of this, by the way, where the Asian... Of course, of course he owns a beauty parlor. <laughs> Darn man looked at this and went, Asian. How, how can I oppress Asians? Well, we're going to have a very uh, Asian store which is you know obviously it's a mani petty store well you know because other than that what the fuck do agents ever do right i mean what what's what does an agent own like a movie theater no <laughs> nice well, work dark what if things get worse you saw how mad he was when he... <laughs> oh my gosh <gasps> what you doing you are taking pictures now yes yeah, it's called evidence retard it's evidence we need to keep a record of all this in case something happens. I don't want to wait around for something to happen. Your husband is actually very right. Are you stupid? We need to move, son. I'm serious. Everything. No, be... you need to take photos and evidence and then call the police or something. Are you fucking... How stupid is your wife? Divorce her. Fine, honey. She's way too stupid for this. Can you please just get in the car? Please? Passenger seat, though, because we all know about Asian women and driving. Am I right? Darman, high five. I'm really worried, son. I don't feel good 
about this? Yeah, me neither, with you behind the wheel. <laughs> you can, I like that you can tell he's wow. hover-handing the scrubbing because he doesn't actually want to disturb the makeup for subsequent takes. <laughs> Wow, they haven't even opened yet, and they already have a line. Don't even look. I'm already scared that he's gonna come here, he's gonna... Oh my gosh, you scared me! Is everything okay? N no, it's not. Yes, don't worry, we're Asian too. Look. We're from Asia, just like you, from the country Asia. Oh no, I can't believe this. Son, how can you take pictures during our timeline? So it would be funny in real life, like, if she said... <laughs> Wait, I saw a Chinese flag. Are you Chinese? And he said, yes, I am. And she said, I'm Japanese. Fuck you. Actually, you should go back to fucking Asia. Fuck you, Chinese man. And he was like, fuck you, Japanese woman. And they hated each other because, you know, not all people from Asia are just in love with each other and the same person. And Darman doesn't know that. That's understandable, obviously, that he completely disregards that different nationalities of asian people hate each other too by the way if this like i don't want to get too fact checky on you guys but if we want it to be accurate as well that the racist should probably not be a white caucasian person i don't think i've seen a single fucking hate crime video committed on asian people that was not a like darker this. persuasion we need we can. of ethnicity committing the crime what we need to do is get out of town just say I don't feel comfortable here anymore. It's not safe for us. Rokim and Kangni. I'm so sorry you ladies have to deal with all of this. You know, go ahead and take the day off and don't worry, you'll still get Oh, there's some employees over here. Are you sure? How about you guys? <laughs> you know, take my wife with you. I'll be fine. <laughs> I just gotta stay here and document all of this. No. Take I'm not my wife with you. you. Please. Let's just go. Ooh. Forget about Salon. We'll figure something else out. No, way. no. Our dream has always been to open our own salon. And now that we have. What else can we do, Jinping? But all we can do is a beauty parlor or a. I, I don't know, a, a Chinese Asian restaurant or like a karate gym. We're Asian, for God's sake, in a Dar Man video. What other store could we possibly run? Please make some sense, wife. Some ignorant bully ruin that for us. All we can do is nails Besides, and kung fu. We put our last dollar into the shop. But it's not safe, son. Please, just come home with me. Honey, if there's one thing I know for sure, is that in the end, love always wins. We can't give in. Love no. trumps hate. We need to stand up for ourselves. That's it's right. The only way we're gonna stop Asian hate. Stop Asian hate, motherfucker. We want to help too. Yeah, we can come back after we drop. No, you ladies all go home. I'll deal with this. Just trust me. But it... uh, please, honey. I'll be okay. I promise. I'll see you later, okay? Motherfucker, you already showed us that you have surveillance cameras. How about report this as harassment? This is a crime. You can't just go around fucking vandalizing people's businesses, by the way, and they'll like smear shit on their cars, and especially if you're being racist about it. Just report the guy. It's not that big of a deal. Call 911, say, hey, my business is being harassed. After his wife left, oh, Sun continues to take pictures and record everything that happened. Sun posts all of the pictures and videos he took on his Facebook and uses the hashtag Stop Asian Hate. <laughs> Before the Stop Asian Hate hashtag, which, by the way, is run by the CIA. I'm pretty convinced at this point. I am like 97-ish percent convinced that the stop Asian hate shit, all of that is run by the CIA. It's a psyop to make people hate the Asians, and it's not gonna work. I'm not going to start hating Asians. Most people are not gonna start hating Asians. Fuck you, CIA. For long, that post quickly goes viral and so many different communities are outraged by what happened. Oh, I like this acting. Different communities are outraged what? by what happened. No, uh he didn't. They leave comments showing their support of Sun and his family. 
The post gets so big that it even attracts the attention of the news. They come out to Sun Shop and do a story on everything that happened. Yeah, what about the cops? Can the they come out? Very quickly hits all the news stations and people in the local community cannot believe what happened. And then the next day, Sun and his wife are in for a big surprise. I don't know about this, Sun. I really don't think it's a good idea. Raiden himself showed up just to fine. show support. I promise. Now come on. So that's weird. That's the first time I've seen Sal's shop without a line in front. Oh, he's been canceled. <gasps> Nani? What's going on? That's our shop. How do we have so many customers? Wow, this is unbelievable. Hey, that's them. We saw you on the news. We're so sorry to hear about what happened. Yes, it's absolutely terrible. We've come here to support you guys. Thank you. Thank you. I can't tell you how much this means to us. We really appreciate it. What's going on here? Ah, there he is. You Finally, I was waiting for this. No. Uh, that's right, bitch. Came here on their yes, own. I am. I guess they found out what kind of person you are. You can't be seriously supporting these people. They don't even belong here. Hey, man. It, while he's yelling at the like, half of them are Asian, the customers. They do belong here. Yeah, what you did. Yeah, that's really right. Cool. Yeah, you should never treat people like that. <laughs> you gotta be joking with me, honey. Salary? <laughs> <laughs> the cops, the cops look like they're out of a porn parody. Finally, they're here. It's it's you gotta be on. joking with me, honey. It's Derek Chauvin. He's he he's finally out of prison. He's about to put his knee on racist man's neck and uh, George Floyd. He's been revived by the power of racial unity. Sal Aaron here to take vengeance yeah. against the racist man. Arrest. Yeah, what? goddamn right you are arrest. with my mirrored American flag. What the fuck? Why why are the flags backwards? What is going on here? That's not a thing cops do, is it? It's me? For vandalism and hate crimes. You have no proof that I did anything wrong? <clears throat> Actually, I do have proof. You see? Yes, it is. What? Cops wear mirrored flags? Why? Chad is telling me that it is, but why? What is the... Is, is there a special reason for them? Oh, is it be... No. Yeah, no, I cannot think of a reason for why it will be mirrored. The police system is backwards. <laughs> now, for a second, I thought, okay, ambulances usually have ambulance written backwards on the front of their hood. So when you're driving in the uh, rearview mirror, when you look back at the ambulance, you can read it uh, front to back. Like the word looks normal to you when you look at it in the front view, uh, in the back of your mirror. But why would you have that for the flag on a on a cop's shoulder? I set up a camera outside and got everything you did on video. I've already turned it over to the police. Retreating? What the fuck are you guys talking about? Police uniform US. No, well, these are obviously just clowns. Show me one with a... I don't think most of them even have US flags, apparently. Yeah, I think the man just picked a fucking porn Halloween costume as a police uniform. Let's try New York City, maybe? Is that where this is taking place? Oh my god, I'm getting gay pride shit. <laughs> That's definitely not it. Okay, it, it will remain an unsolved mystery. This can't be happening. You should be taking him away. He doesn't even belong in this country. Get him out of here. Move him. Oh, device says he's Googled it apparently. Basically, the idea behind the backward American flag on army uniforms is to make it look as though the flag is flying in the breeze as the person wearing it moves forward. During the Civil War, both mounted cavalry and infantry units would designate a standard bearer who carried the flag into battle. It's kind of dumb. 
Yeah, clap. We love our police. Yeah, because all those, all those ethnic minorities, they just love the police. The end. Love always wins. I love you so much. <laughs> I love you too. Uh, all right, come on. Let's get everybody inside. Son, this is incredible. Hurry up, son. Let's open it. Yeah, so many stinky feet for you to pedicure. <laughs> We cured racism by the power of feet. I can't be oh, it's about a, a couple that just opened a new nail salon. Yeah, and wonderful set. This is boring. Come on. Right, let me let me rant. Wait, wait. Mean Girls shame this YouTuber. Oh, is it Psycho Mantis? Hey, Garmin fam. Fuck I'm off. super dope. Fuck off. Super Fuck off both you weirdos. Let's watch it. All right. Dad. Let's go ahead and start. Hi, guys. I'm here with my dad, and we're going to practice one last time before the talent show. Ready? Yeah. I done seen city back that ain't like this. I'm the man in Instagram. Take my pig like this. Oh. I have to take this phone call again. I'm sorry. Okay. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> wow, Galani. Don't tell me you're dancing in the talent show with your dad. <laughs> Are you really surprised? Everyone knows she doesn't have any friends. <laughs> <laughs> That's not true. My dad, my friend. And what? We're you have a dad? <laughs> wow. Anyway. I, like, I like three girls with obvious daddy issues. Mad at the, the girl with the dad. Who vlogs with her dad is definitely a loser. <laughs> <laughs> no, my favorite YouTube channel, the LeBrant Fam, the daughter Everly dances and vlogs with her dad. Cole. The what? My fam? favorite YouTube channel. Is that a real channel? This looks like an Aryan, like white power racist poster. LeBrant Fam. Oh my God, it's real. Of course it's real. What do they even do? Why do these channels exist? I'll keep the vlog. Shut up. Oh my god, who watches these? Why? And all the LeBrant fam, the daughter Everly dances and vlogs with her dad Cole. And they're actually not losers, they're really cool. And I want a channel just like them. <laughs> <laughs> you want to have a YouTube channel? And how are you ever going to get subscribers? Oh my god, you loser. subscriber will be her dad. <laughs> you want to be a Twitch streamer? Listen, Ugh, look at them all. Okay. Look, he's coming now. Let's go. It's going to be fun watching you lose tonight. To Pink Velvet. That's right, Pink oh, Velvet, that. whoever that is. Fine. Those girls were just making fun of me for not having friends. Hey, it's okay. You've got me, right? <laughs> I'll always be your friend. They were making fun of me, oh, Dad, oh, for being an oh, ethnic minority and wearing a Third Reich propaganda poster on my shirt, on my hoodie. From the top. Yeah? I done seen city <laughs> That's like... fine, Dad. <laughs> Daddy, I was telling them that white is right, sure? and they told me that I'm not white. I want to cry in the girls' bathroom now. <laughs> Are you guys ready to start the talent show? Wow, there's so many people out there. Uh, don't worry. It's going to go great. You ready? Yeah. I just need to use the bathroom real quick. Augie's asking if these are English I'm so learning nervous. videos. There are what? so are they? many people here. I don't think they are. I really hope that I don't look who it is. <gasps> Bully wow. moment. I'm surprised. Did they just pop into existence? So they weren't even in the frame. People here. And I really yeah. hope that I don't look who it is. Wow. I'm surprised you didn't need to bring your dad in here with you. <laughs> <laughs> Leave me alone. Nice camera. Let me see that. Nice Stop. camera. <laughs> I can't believe you think anybody would ever watch your vlogs. No one cares about a loser and her dad. Stop it. Give me that. Let go. 
my camera. Oh, thank you, Diabolical. You broke it. Not like it matters. No one was gonna watch your dumb vlog anyway. I just saved you the embarrassment of having posted it. Oh, it's almost our time on stage. We should go. Let's go win this thing, ladies. Holy shit, who still has any of those phones? Whoa, sweetheart, hey, are uh, you okay? Sure. No, I don't want to do the dance anymore. Wait, where are you going? All right, thanks for letting hey, me know, diabolical. Please stop for a second. What's going on? I, I yelled white here. power, Dad. Dancing I put my, my fist up. I did I the Z Kyle. And they still made thinking? fun of me. I thought that was your whole dream. <laughs> to be like... The LeBrat family? No. Is it just me? Not he looks more. exactly. Hang on. I don't want to wear this stupid anymore. He looks exactly like the cop and tell me why. What was his name again? Oh, the fuck, not YouTube, sorry. Anybody remember his name? The, the person that. Uh, what's his face is yelling at right here? Eddie? Tell me why, Eddie. Who the hell is this? Oh, this guy kind of looks like that too. Do all the people named Eddie look the same? What the fuck? Who is... Well, I guess kinda. Well, not really. Maybe I was wrong. I misremembered. We won't want to wear this stupid hoodie anymore. Oh, no. I I'm so sorry. <gasps> it's gonna... That's all right. Oh, my gosh. Blonde and blue-eyed. You yeah. are Cole nice Alber LeBron. Is everything okay? Sorry, I just can't believe I'm meeting you. You don't understand. I watch all your family's vlogs. <laughs> okay, it's similar. <laughs> <laughs> These girls keep calling me a loser because I don't have any friends. And because I want to start vlogging with my dad. And First show off, white. I love the vlog idea. Do that. And second, not having friends doesn't make you a loser. It doesn't? Of course not. You can be cool all by yourself. And besides, I'm pretty sure you have at least one friend. Your dad. And that's all that really matters. Ah. You're so right. I can't believe I almost left the talent show. Self-image issues a soul. We're almost done. Well, I guess we better get going. Thank you, Cole. You're welcome. And make sure you vlog. Yeah, who it. said we're on a first name basis, bitch? Oh shoot. I forgot my camera broke. Well, why don't you try recording with my phone? No. Why does why doesn't Cole just conveniently pull out a ten thousand dollar camera out of his YouTuber backpack? Yeah, that one. It's okay. Let's just go. Hey. <laughs> Here's my camera. Ah, uh, yeah, of course. Are you serious? Th that's too much. We can't take that. Hey, no, either I'm, I'm really psychic or Darman is predictable taken. drivel. Thank you so much, Cole. Can the dad have some, like, I don't know, pride or shame or something where he goes, Thank you so much, man, but we can't accept that. Like, I can't just take your 50,000 fucking dollar lens and Canon camera for a... What, an elementary school talent show? Never forget this. He just smiles like, yeah, give me money. Give me free shit. Can you pay the mortgage for our house, too? Thank you. Thanks for the charity. By the way, he, he just hands over the camera with complete disregard to the, I guess, modern cameras would use SD cards and shit. Like, hey, here's my camera. It has some behind the scenes YouTube footage and my girlfriend's nudes. Um, that's OK, right? You're, you promise not to leak those? OK, cool. Here you go, seven year old.
a death slayer <laughs> 92 your name sounds like someone who would be on dar man Huge audience. Oh no. Did they film an actual performance for this? No. Kehlani and her dad continued to do the dance and impress the entire crowd. When they finished, the crowd goes wild and gives them a standing ovation. <laughs> it does. Based on the audience's reaction, there was no doubt who the winner of the talent show was. Kehlani picks up her camera and continues to vlog this unforgettable moment. Everyone the camera, which so she somehow excited. magically knows how to operate. Well, mostly <laughs> everyone at least. When Kehlani gets home, the first thing she does is edit the video and upload it onto YouTube. She posts yeah. it under her new... The Rodriguez fam takes over the talent show. Family channel. With Not even a... Under her new My dad and I practice all month for the talent show. Paid off. And, and, and a plug and a link to the video itself. Which doesn't even match the link of the video. Like, how about a thank you? Like, thank you, LeBron's family, or whatever the fuck the white Aryan white power family is, the KKK family. It's not even a thanks. New family channel. Within a short time, the video ends up going viral. They end up gaining hundreds of thousands of subscribers from all Yay. over the world. Kehlani couldn't believe it. Neither can I. No one can. She continues vlogging for their family channel and doing even more dances with her dad. Their views and subscribers continue to explode. And then, a Check few months later, Kehlani uh, happens to run into Pink Velvet. They just broke one million subscribers. Yeah, Look, see then cope, I've bitch. I've never met anyone with that many subs. I don't understand what's so special about her. Look, there she is. She's famous, talk and to she them. has a expensive camera. All right, Rodriguez fam. See you in the next vlog. Hey, Kalani. I just wanted to say. Oh my God, I always thought you were fan. cool, actually. Um, you're like our favorite YouTubers. Can we get a pic? Of course, yeah. Thank you, thank you so much! I can't believe that just happened! Oh, uh, sorry about that. Then she turned 18 so and went on OnlyFans, yeah. You and your dad yeah. are, like, famous now. became a booby streamer on um, Twitch. Well, I wouldn't say all that. Well, we were wondering if you ever want to I want to fuck us. your dad. Yeah. He's famous now. Imagine, the Rodriguez fam does a collab with Pink Velvet. Our right, imagine you crazy. go fuck yourself. Okay, I get the really? idea. Yeah! God, no, not really. Go. Oh, you're so stupid, young Maybe girl. Maybe you could even be our friend and we could all hang out together. Say no. <laughs> wow. Uh... No. No. That's okay. No. I already have the thank one you. friend I need. But then... Fuck my life. Thank you. Are there any Darman videos that are... That don't end in a sappy... Oh, I like the... Oh, here. The same, uh... Father... Janitor humiliated by coworker. Let's see what else we have. Oh, it's Kamali or Kamala or whatever her name was. Mean girl shamed as you. Oh, that's the one we just watched. Shit. Um, male coach harasses female player. Fuck yeah, give me that straight to my veins. Husband won't let wife work. Kids laugh at student who can't spell. <laughs> Um, root man humili 
humiliates elderly lady, student gets humiliated, shy kids get, get humiliated. Girl denies roommate based on her looks. Uh, popular girl fat shames, gold digger shames guy at bar. These nerds get made fun of, girl shamed for skin problems, rich girl refuses to tip waitress. Oh, you know, here's what we're gonna do. All the ladies in the chat, if you are a woman, if you're femoid, tell me which one of these you have experienced IRL, and that's the one we're gonna play, and we're gonna see if it matches with your experience in real life. Ladies, tell me, what do you what do you face? Mom forces girl to play with Barbies. Is that a is that a struggle you fat being forced to play with Barbies? Hannah is the only woman. Well then, Hannah will have to pick. Boss treats female staff unfair at work. Bright goes back to ex boyfriend on wedding night. That makes her the cunt. Which mom shames his poor mom. Girl steals clothes. I've been harassed by a boss. Okay, uh, so we can watch. I guess this, I, I, a coach, I suppose, counts as a boss. Star athlete. There's my star athlete. Come here. Uh, hey, Larry. How His are name you? is oh. Steve. Uh, should we get started? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Uh, let's work on some stretching first. All right, we need you nice and loose. Steep. <laughs> Start with the hamstrings. Oh. Okay. okay. Did, did you like? There's my star athlete. Come here. Uh, hey, Larry. How are you? Oh. Uh, That's not immediately we get like. Mm. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, let's work on some. Has he raped her before? All right. We need you nice and loose for the. That's not a normal reaction to being told, "Hey, there's my star athlete," and uh, somebody just wanted to hug you. That's the reaction you have only against someone who's already molested you. Okay. Um. Sounds great. Okay, we'll start with the hamstrings. Oh. Is that okay. a tennis racket? So, you know all the college scouts are going to be at this tournament. With the right introductions, you could end up with a full ride scholarship. And one day even become pro, huh? The music is oh way too loud. That'd be my dream. I've been practicing tennis my whole life for this moment. God damn it. There's my star athlete. Come here. Uh, I was hey trying Larry. to turn off the annotations. I'm sorry. With a scholarship. And one day even become pro. Huh? Oh my god. That'd be my dream. I've been practicing tennis my whole life for this moment. Yeah, well, in this sport, it's, it's not what you know. It's... Who you know. <laughs> Remember ha, ha, ha. That? You just do uh -huh. what I say and oh. I'll make that dream happen. There you go. Okay. Good. Uh, why is this so hard? You know what? Let me help you. What kind of fucking athletes is it? Why is this so hard? Oh my god. You take the ball. This blows. Oh, I'm sorry. Bad touch. Bad touch. I'm comfortable. I'm trying to help you get better. I mean, you do want that scholarship, don't you? Well, yeah. Well, then you're gonna have to deal with me having a semi in my pants. You understand? Good. This looks like a bad porn intro. The coach is so big. So why don't you come by my place tonight and we'll practice? <laughs> Excuse me. <laughs> How are you gonna practice tennis in some dude's house in his living room? Ah, that yeah, sure. That sounds uh, yeah. Wow. Realistic really? and. Okay, well, Promising. maybe I should introduce them to someone else. Someone who's a little more interested in getting a scholarship. No, no, I'm serious. It's just, I don't okay, know. Okay, good. Be in my place at 8. I'll text you the address. Mm, nope. Hey. 
Hey, girl. How was practice? Bad, Danishka. I'm getting right. raped, I think. Sure. He invited me tonight good. to get raped. It's Rapey. Larry. He always makes me feel so Rapey Larry. uncomfortable. The way he looks at me. Looks at you. He fucking pushed his dick in your ass. Basically, he, he did way more than fucking look. How close he gets. Can't, you can't blame a guy yeah, for looking, so that's but... That's not normal. Getting touchy, that's rapey. I have to. He's one of the top coaches in the country. You don't need him. Listen to me. The only person who decides how successful you become is you. Remember that. And Harry Weinstein. There she is. The door, which was split open for some reason. God damn it, they're in this Hi. weird house hey. against ugly ass Sit. marble wall house. Hey! Sit. She's ready to practice, y'all. With her hair done, makeup perfectly done, nails done. No tennis racket, no workout clothing, no nothing. Just. She appeared dressed as a woman would for a first date, but she's totally ready to play tennis. So, and, uh, I mean, mind you, he's ready to teach tennis with wine. He's half a bottle into drinking. He's dressed up all in his... I don't even know what the style is called. Casual business? I don't know. He's all rapey is what I'm saying. But he really wants to teach her how to hit a tennis ball. So, can I get you something to drink? Some wine, perhaps? Uh, no. Before we play tennis? Thanks. I'm not even 21. I Whoa! Would can we just talk about the college scouts? Relax. She is 21. We've got plenty of time to talk about tennis. How about we talk about something more interesting, like you? What are you what are you doing? Come on, don't What are you doing? Like oh my god, that's so weird. I want for Like I showed up in full makeup and I had my hair done. I showed up in like nice cute clothing and you're all dressed up and this is like a date or something. You have wine outs and you have none of us have any intention of playing tennis. What are you doing? This is like getting too romantic. Oh my god. From you is for you to help me become a successful tennis player. Nothing else. Exactly. And like I told you, in this sport, it's not about what you know, it's about who you know. Oh, huh? he's so aggressive. So, you make me happy. Forget about tennis, learn about tennis. I'll make you successful. The only person who decides how successful you become <gasps> is you. No. You know what? I don't need you. I can do this on my own. I can cancel you. Goodbye, Larry. What? You you think you can walk away from me? You'll never be successful without me. We'll see about that. <laughs> this is so is awfully acted and cringe, but it, like the sad thing is, Harvey Weinstein did this in real life and it worked. You know? And I can't imagine him being any nicer than this or any more convincing than this. Nessa leaves the coach's house Poor determined girls. to make it on her own. Now even more inspired, Vanessa is ready to work harder than she ever has before. She starts practicing all the time on her own, spending hours on the court each day. <laughs> Before long, she begins acing her serves. She's playing better than she ever has before. You can tell she's never played tennis before. That's amazing. And then comes the day of the big tournament. Vanessa signs in, feeling confident and ready to play. As Larry is molesting she a new feels girl. Good knowing she's made the right decision. That's right. On the day of the tournament, Vanessa quickly beats her first. Not opponent. to undermine the point of the video or anything, but like tennis getups for women are very underrated. 
just my very non she then wins her second biased opinion as a man all of her sets those like half and even goes half booty shorts half skirts are very unpleasant advancing all the way to the finals and then came the moment she was waiting <laughs> not for. to be a pig or anything now leads 40 to 30 <laughs> in this tiebreaker game serving for match point And she wins on the serve. Ooh, she won in one swing. And the coach will have to cope and see. Well, well, well. Look who it is. What do you want, Larry? Well, you may have won the tournament, but uh, where's the college scholarship, huh? Try to tell you that without me, you'll never get a scholarship. Excuse me, Vanessa. <laughs> Great performance today. My name's Dan Walters. I'm the scout for Stanford University. Should I'm I also Dracula. Or your coach. Uh, oh, I don't have a coach, but you can talk to me. Great. We would love to talk to you about a full Great. I'd love to suck your blood. To come play for us. How does that sound? I admire your talent. Really? Oh my god, that'd be amazing. Thank you so much. Wait, wait, wait. No, she where? Have a coach. She the has next no Olympics is in the Transylvania. Oh, it's not who you know, it's what you know. And all you need to be successful is you. Come on, let's uh, walk and talk. He sounds creepier than Larry. Wow. <laughs> this day cannot get worse. That guy is for sure going answer. to invite the girl back you to his place to have hey, a Prince training Ross, session with wine. Something wrong? We've had complaints from parents and students about inappropriate behavior. What? No, no, no. That is it, this has got to be some kind of mistake. I mean, clearly there's what? some big misunderstanding here. There's no is this one of the dads? If so, beat the shit out of him. What the fuck? Uh, we have some complaints about you. No, kill him then. No way. He's molesting your daughter. Yes, cop. How about you come with us? No, Larry Hassler, cop. Be more based than red pill. Where's your reverse flag? Shoot him in the head. God damn it. Hey, Darman fam, make sure to subscribe <laughs> to my channels and check out this next video. I know oh my you're god. Love this fucking guy. Okay, we have husband, won't let the wife work. We have girl that has roommate based on looks. Uh, oh, and I have... Okay, let's close these. Okay, I really want to do this one. Husband won't let wife work. I'm going to start playing this real quick and also go pee, but I'm going to rush. I'll run. I'll run straight back so I don't miss a single minute. BRB. Just like that. <laughs> Whoa. Daddy! How's work? Hey, sweetheart. It was long. Starving. What's for dinner? Oh, hi. I was just about to start cooking. You still haven't made dinner yet? No, um... And this kitchen, it's a complete mess. See, I don't understand. You're a stay-at-home mom, so what have you been doing all day? You're baking cupcakes again? Selena, we talked about this. Honey, why don't you give your daddy and I a moment, huh, sweetheart? Okay. Do not tell me you're trying to start this dumb baking business again. Carlos, before you say anything, please just try one of these. They're delicious. I don't care. The last time you tried starting this cupcake business, it was <sighs> a complete disaster. Just here in the I West. know. It's back. But do you know how difficult it's been to stay home all day ever since Rosa was born? I want to feel inspired again. What I miss? Please, just give it one more chance. I know this can be big. No, beat her. 
Peter. My job pays me six thousand dollars a month. Peter, How Muslim much did man. Baking business bring in nothing. Instead, it put us ten grand in credit card debt that I'm still trying to pay off. Wait, how much? That, instead, it put us ten grand in credit card debt that I'm still trying to pay off. You make six grand a month, but you're ten thousand dollars in debt. It shouldn't take you that long to pay off. I mean, it sucks. Ten thousand dollars is a lot, but if you're making six thousand a month, that's like fine. It's not life ending. You can pay that off. That's why we decided you would take care of Rosita in the house and I would work. But Carlos, pero nada. If you were the bread, pero winner, nada, so cabron. In more than six grand, then I'd gladly stay. Donde está mi dinero, eh? So then know your role. Are we expecting someone? Can I help you? Hi, I have a delivery for Selena Sweets. Selena Sweets? Yes. <gasps> Is she using her maiden name? <gasps> have a good day. No. Yes, they're here. What is this? I thought I told you no more online Did that say, oh, this isn't real. <laughs> What is this? Oh, quick lock. Is that one of Darman's businesses? I bet it is. I thought I told you no more online shopping. This isn't shopping. This is more like an investment. Capron, what are you saying? See, this is the new packaging for my business. No. No. You had a puta. dollars on some worthless boxes. How did you pay for this? I, I put it on our card but don't worry about it i already have wait, my wait, how much? dollars on some worthless oh hundred dollars that's Boxes. nothing that's fine how did you pay for this uh, i put it on our card but don't worry about it i already have my first order so i'll be able to pay it off quickly you see you can't be serious it's about your stickers chill the fuck out deeper in credit card debt I'm not trying. Oh, to what happened to, to Big Man dance, Boss um, Master I'm Macho making off. six thousand bucks a month? This idea a chance, please. Mommy, is dinner ready? I'm hungry. No, Rosa, dinner Rosa. is not ready. Because your mom is more worried about wasting our money than feeding her own husband and daughter. What a great <gasps> wife and mom you are. She's making muffins and like cupcakes. I know a thing or two about making cupcakes because I, I, I 3D render them, but you know. I'm sorry, baby. I'm gonna start dinner right away. Okay. I'm sorry, Rosa. I'm home. Oh, hi, honey. Don't worry, dinner's already done. And I made your favorite. Enchiladas. No, no, no. That's no man's favorite. Every man's favorite is chili con carne. Okay, mi amor. This is more like it. I even cleaned the kitchen. Did you see? Come on, take a seat. I'll get your fork. I also have one more surprise. Really? Low job. What? My first payment, two hundred dollars. Can you believe it? Good. We can use this towards the credit card debt you stuck us with. Yeah. Hi, you well, dick. I um, I was thinking that maybe we can reinvest that, and I can get some more supplies, and I can make some more money, and I can help you pay off the credit card debt sooner. What, what is he so pissed off about? She doubled about? her money. She invested $100. She made back 200 which means she made $100 in profit. Good. Good. That, that is good. She's profiting. Profit is good. Uh, what's his face? Your job is to Generic misogynist That's Hispanic it. man. But Carlos, I've already Carlos, of course, his name is Carlos. <laughs> But Pablo, we can't, we can't sustain ourselves off of your drug smuggling business. Come on. A <laughs> hundred dollars in one day. I make that in three hours. But 
Carlos. Oh, you make that in three hours, yet you whine about it like a little baby. This has always been my dream. All I've ever wanted is to have this. I can't believe how ungrateful you are to be able to stay home and do nothing. If you were the breadwinner, I'd happily stay home and not complain the way you do. Our prediction, this video is going to end with her out earning him by a lot. And he's going to have to cope with the fact that he now has to be a stay at home dad. Oh, how am I supposed to make money if I can't work? All I need is a month. Please, Carlos, having a baking business has been all I've ever wanted. Just it's not comes. even like a bad business for a woman in this completely made up fictional lunacy straw man scenario that Darman made up. Even here, like a baker wife who wants to bake cupcakes. That is so sweet. That's like, that is not some progressive dystopia where, you know, your wife wants to have a fucking OnlyFans or something. She wants to bake cookies be a trad wife and sell them for immense profit. Good, okay. Why would you not like Please. that? She wants to bake nice things. Let your wife bake, Fine. for God's sake. I'll give you a week and that's it. And if, when you fail, I never <laughs> want you baking again. You what? understand? What? Yeah, okay, fine. No man has ever said, no, I don't ever want you baking right again. And I cancel your credit card so you don't make any more bad decisions. Oh, okay. Well, how Fuck am I you. supposed to buy any more supplies? Maybe you should just give up now then. Just like you gave up on speaking Spanish with me in our own household and for some reason we're yelling at each other in English, our second language. <laughs> you know, you just ruined my appetite with all this complaining. Thanks a lot. Uh, Carlos. Da. Bah. Pusa. Selena starts to cry, feeling like her dream has been shattered. But then she gets a phone call that would change her life forever. <laughs> this is Taco Bell. <laughs> Hello? Oh, hi. Mr. Man. Uh, of course, he's the hero. Mr. Man is the hero. Order? <laughs> really? Uh, this guy had to well, self-insert him. Actually, himself. Don't have the money to. You'll pay up front. Oh, Mr. Darman, you're so amazing. Course, yes. And you're Thank hung. You so much. Oh yes. my God, you're such a virile, rich, young man, entrepreneur. Oh my God, yes. Oh my God. Yes. Mommy. Uh huh. Where's Dad? Oh, um, he'll be right back, honey. Why don't you go sit down and have some dinner? Go ahead. So, sweetheart, after dinner, do you want to help mommy bake some more cupcakes? Child labor. That's illegal. Selena now feels more inspired than ever. She uses the thousand dollars to get more supplies and keeps baking with her daughter. As word spreads about her delicious cupcakes, how the fuck does one person more? make like a thousand dollars worth of cupcakes? That's literally like I don't know how much cupcakes cost, but like hundreds. We're talking hundreds of cupcakes. We're in more orders from one person. I don't think it's possible. She starts to earn more cash than she ever has before. She reinvests that money to expand her baking operation by using her friends. Oh no, Hannah's, Hannah's muting people. Oh, do I have a hater in the chat? Hang on. Hannah deleted Ryuzi's message. Fucker, I hope you kill yourself. N word. Did I just get called the N word? Bro. Bra, am I getting hate crimes in my own stream? That is not okay. Where are you? Where is that chatter? No, no, no. I will not be a victim of a hate crime. 
okay, we live in Darman reality here. That is not okay. Well, f first of all, first of all, sir. What's his name again? Uh, oh, damn it, I lost the name. Oh. Ryuze saying, fucker, I hope you kill yourself. N-word. First of all, I'm a sand N-word. Not just N-word. If you're gonna be racist, get it right. But, little did you realize, I have very base trad women cupcake bakers in my chat ready to shut down fucking trolls and haters and hate crimers and racists. It's okay. This is my truth and I'm living it and I think I will survive it, you guys. It's okay. It hurts, but... As an LGBTQIA plus mental health creator, I'm used to this, unfortunately. Commercial kitchen and even hire some people to help her. <laughs> Selena was finally doing what she always dreamed of. A full week goes by and then one day her husband comes home from work. More he comes home to... Four, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven packs, you guys, eleven boxes of cupcakes. Which, that is heaven to me, okay? If my wife baked eleven packages of uh, cupcakes, I'm good, I'm not gonna complain. Yet, he's going to find a way to complain. Watch, watch Carlos, Pablo, Juan, uh, Escobar. Eight packages? This place is a complete mess. Oh, I'm sorry, honey. I am gonna move all this stuff tomorrow. Good. I'm glad this week is over so you can give up on that dumb idea of yours. Fuck you. Oh, I meant I am going to be moving this stuff into my new kitchen. You see, I'm going to continue working instead. What are you talking about? I told you you have seven days and your time is up. You've already stressed me out so much with this 10 grand debt. I don't need any more problems. What debt? Do you have amnesia? <laughs> the one you stuck us with the last time your bright idea didn't work. Oh. The last time I ate her idea, she doubled her money. I wish I could double my money. Yeah. Um, you may want to take a look at that again. What? Did you find a way to charge up more on our card? Was my autoplay on? Uh, I, I use a version of Brave where every time I exit the app, it deletes my cookies and I think the autoplay thing is a cookie. That's why. Zero balance? I don't ah. understand. How did this happen? Now this must be some mistake. Cause she makes it's money, biatch. Mistake, Carlos. I paid it off. You see, while you've been working, I also have been working. Well, Rosa. And I, and a few friends. <laughs> no, that's not possible. That would mean... You made 10 grand? In a week? Yeah, cocksucker, divorce him. He's about to... Uh-oh, he's about to turn the tables on her. He's about to quit his job and be a stay-at-home dad and sue for divorce and take half her shit. Girl, divorce him right now, so you don't owe him any money, right? If you make that much money, if you make 10 grand in a week, that is, you're now a millionaire, basically. You are, if you're not a millionaire now, you're going to be a millionaire in like one or two years. Divorce him, drop the anchor, cut ties to this piece of shit. Well, actually, she made more than that. <laughs> Why are you trying to please him? Is this for real? Oh my gosh. Serve him the divorce I, I papers. It, Selena. Yup. And I just signed a huge contract to supply cupcakes to some local oh my God. restaurants. So I guess you can say things are on the up and up. <laughs> <laughs> wow. No, stop smiling, you fucking so cock sucking you, piece honey. of shit. If I you make 10 grand a week, ladies, hit me up. What'd you make? I'm starving. I'm way more appreciative oh, than this actually, man. Actually, I didn't make anything. I was waiting for you. 
You see, because I made more than six grand, technically, that makes me the breadwinner. So Ooh. I thought maybe. Oh, shit. Cook me dinner, bitch. Make me a sandwich. Okay. You can't be serious. You yeah, got them right, she is, motherfucker. You better learn. Yeah, no. You're gonna make a sandwich. You're gonna make a sandwich, Carlos Pablo Juan Escobar. You're gonna get on your knees and you're gonna give her a blowjob. Rosa and I were starving. <laughs> hey, darn man, fam. What? Check out this next video. I know you're. So, what is the rest of this? Maybe because it's a little. This is. I just figured it. You figured Did Dharma and accidentally edit two videos together? Rosa? Cheers. Bam, bam, check out this next video. I know you're gonna love it. Cheers. Cheers. <laughs> I'm sorry, sir, but your car was declined. Um, well, run it again. I'm sorry, sir, but I did. Did he film Here. two things? Take mine. Making the exact mm -hmm. same point? I cannot believe this. You really love rubbing your money in my face, don't you? Oh my god, he did. Man, no. Where are you going? Thank you. Thanks. Thank you guys so much for coming out tonight. I know it's really late. Yeah, we really appreciate you coming and celebrating Ben's birthday with us. Mm -hmm. Well, it's almost Ben's birthday. Mm -hmm. It will be in a few minutes once it hits midnight. Yeah. <laughs> Don't rub it in. Miss it for the world. And really glad you guys finally got to meet Lindsay too. <laughs> yeah, I was wondering when Aaron was gonna finally introduce me to his friends. <laughs> <laughs> to be honest with you guys, I have been wanting to come here ever since this place opened. Right? I hear the steak is amazing. What are you thinking about having this? Actually, the steak does sound pretty good. Mm -hmm. um, take a look here. $55? Who would pay that kind of money for a steak? Don't worry about it, sweetheart. People who can afford it's it. It's birthday. I'll pay for it. Get whatever you want. It's fine, okay? I, I don't need you paying for my dinner. What kind of a man would I be if I let my girl pay for my food, right? Mm. I mean, I kind of get that, but... Like, don't go to an expensive so, uh, restaurant then. Ben, congrats on the new job. Ben just got a new job at the local hospital. Oh, wow. Yeah. That's great. Congrats. Um, so are you a doctor or a nurse? Actually, uh, I'm a receptionist there. Aww. Jen got me the job. It's the, the hospital where she works. Oh, nice, man. <laughs> I didn't know you two worked together. You know, Lindsay and I worked together, too. Yeah, it definitely takes some getting used to, that's, that's for sure. That's true. <laughs> yeah, that's a bad idea. So, are you a receptionist there too, Jen? No, she's no, a surgeon. I'm um, a doctor there. Damn right. Oh, wow, that's really impressive. <laughs> ben, why don't you tell me your girlfriend's a doctor? I work with Dr. House. Maybe because it's a little embarrassing. This guy was on a previous Maybe episode with our man. I successful don't than I am. He played Honey. Though. You shouldn't be embarrassed about that. I am very proud of you. And besides, if one of us succeeds, what would I we both it? succeed. Erica. A because five? <laughs> it wasn't awful. I mean, it was awful, I guess. But keep in mind, again, Erica costs eight bucks. For that price, you can't complain too much about a bad game. I think it's okay. Oh, I actually really like that. I'd be way more harsh if it was AAA prices. Oh, shoot, it's probably almost midnight. Uh, what time has it been? Let's see. This, this thing's always busted. I mean, I don't know. I, I, I'm saving up to buy a new one. Oh my Let's god, just use our phone. Actually, it's midnight. Oh my gosh! Happy Yay! Birthday. You turned 27? <laughs> So, uh, 30? Ben, got a little surprise for you. Oh, you guys didn't have to do that. Oh, no, open it up. <laughs> Let's see. Ooh. Oh, yeah. New watch! Oh, wow. Did you get a Rolex? Oh, is it getting a Gucci, Gucci wallet? Nice. Gucci <laughs> this wallet. This must have cost a fortune. How did you guys afford this? 
Uh, well, it was actually. Who the fuck wants a Gucci man. wallet? We both chipped in. <laughs> this is really great. Thank you. I, I I really appreciate it. It's my turn. My turn. Oh boy. Mm -hmm. Happy yeah. birthday, baby! What do we got here? Oh, oh there we go. You've been wanting a new watch. I bet he's gonna get a purse. Oh, watch. Jesus, you bought me the watch. I told you that I wanted to pay for it myself. Ah, oh, well, so mad. Now you don't need to. I just figured it. You figured what? That I couldn't afford it? No. Yeah. No. <laughs> yes. I'm not going to say that <laughs> at all. You know, I know you make a lot more money than I do, but I don't need you rubbing it in my face. Like I said, I will pay for it myself. I know. I just thought. Hello. Uh, have you guys decided what you want to order? Is that Darman? I'll have the steak. Have you Is the waiter Darman? I know. I just thought. Hello. Uh, have you guys decided what you want to order? It is Dar man. God damn Honestly. it, really. You had to self-insert. Man, that steak was amazing. <laughs> yeah, now I see why it costs $55. I mean, I am stuffed here. Uh -huh. Hi, and uh, here's your check. I'll leave it's this not, for you right here. It's here. not Darman. No, I'll Perfect. just take that. No, 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 no. I got it. I got it. Here you go. Oh, thank you. Sweetheart, it's your birthday. What, like I can't handle it or something? No. No, I never said that. Oh, my God. Cheers. Cheers. <laughs> I'm sorry, sir, but your car was declined. <laughs> um, what kind of person? Even if you're like piss poor, fifty like fifty bucks of a steak times what four four people there? That two hundred bucks. Who does not have even two hundred bucks in savings? Even if you're extremely poor, two hundred bucks. Like this man is living in absolute abject poverty. Dating a doctor, I guess. No, okay, fuck you guys. You got... Okay, if you try to say face and did not want to be embarrassed in public, you could still afford $200 in credit card fees. Well, run it again. I'm sorry, sir, but I did. Here. Take mine. Thank you. Mm -hmm. I cannot believe this. You really love rubbing your money in my face, don't you? No. Ah, uh, you love no. rubbing your money in my face and paying for dinner so we don't end up in jail for not paying. What happened back there, man? Everything okay? I'm just so sick of my girlfriend being more successful than I am. I mean, she uh, makes more money than me. It's, it's embarrassing. Such natural dialogue. Look, there's nothing wrong with that. I'm supposed to be the man of the house, okay? I'm the one who's supposed to be making more money. <laughs> Don't be a fucking secretary, then. What the fuck do you want? Like, oh, I'm the a big, big alpha man macho. But I also, I scrub toilets for a living, okay? You don't get it, you know, you're showing up here giving fancy gifts, and I'm showing up here with a freaking broken watch. <laughs> you don't understand. Well, actually, I do. I'm I poor to too, brother. Look, man, I... I was a little embarrassed to tell you this, but... I'm poor. I haven't been 100% transparent with you. I'm poor. Tell him. Tell him, Pashid. Earlier when I said Lindsay and I work together, well, what I didn't tell you is she's actually... I'm just her male boy. <gasps> Just the assistant. Oh! She makes oh way no! More than I do. And about the expensive wallet, it actually wasn't from both of us. Lindsay bought it because I didn't have enough money to get you anything. <gasps> she so what? It was from her, not me. So you see, I do. So you what see. It's like to be in your shoes, because my girl is a lot more successful than me too. <sighs> oh, the horror. I earn money, and my partner earns money. This is a nightmare. I had no idea that Lindsay was your boss. Hey, it's okay. Look, just because she's more successful than me, that doesn't make me any less of a man. And at the end of the day, if one of us succeeds, then we both succeed, because we're a team. Sure. I guess I never really thought about it that way. 
It's okay. Give you guys some space to talk. Why are the girls entering the men's bathroom? Hey, cuck. I'm sorry about... No, listen, I'm sorry. What happened back there, that was embarrassing. I should have never acted that way. I'm just... I've been so intimidated by your success. It's okay. Sexism solved. You should never feel that way. I am so proud of the guy that you are. It doesn't even matter how much money you make. No, right. not buying that. At the end of the day, we're a team. I should have never forgotten that. Nope. So, does that mean you're gonna accept my present now? Of course. <laughs> I love your present. Yeah, I love you. Can't wait to get an Asian CEO <laughs> girlfriend. <laughs> hey, Darman fam, make yeah. sure. No, to not hey, Darman. Fuck you. Fuck off. Fuck off with these weird, goofy-ass, made-up straw man things. Ah, oh, what if your girlfriend made so much more money than you? Um... Is there any... Ah, fuck. I've been going for over three hours. I think this is the last one I'll watch. Gang. Hi, I'm Amy. I'm here about the room you have for rent. Oh my god, it's just oh, finally, right out the gate. Half decent. <laughs> High energy. You have no idea how many trashy people have been through here today. Ooh, I'm so sorry. <laughs> yeah, me too. <laughs> Kaya would be a state Wait, is that the new limited too. edition Gucci hey, bag? I, I make That's good like money. $3,000. But <laughs> yeah. if a millionaire lady picked me up, I'd be okay with that. I'm not gonna... Hmm. It's hard. I think I would still want to pay for food. I would still like to um, be able to say that I pay for dinner and everything because I'm. it's not like I'm poor, but I wouldn't mind a woman making more money than me. Am I going to save the VOD? I think I can. I don't think I've said anything too controversial on this stream. <laughs> Well, you're going to have no problem paying the rent, that's for sure. It's 1800 a month, but that includes utilities. Let me show you around. Yes. Hi, I'm here to see the room that's available. I'm just saying that as long as I'm I can sorry, afford it, I would I like to pay age. for every oh, meal if we're I'm out of eating. I'm not on uh, any eating. government assistance program. Is the room still available? No offense, but the room is almost $2,000. Okay, so the... Girl denies roommate based on her looks. I don't think it's the looks. I think that she's racist, right? That would be great, actually. Immediately I've been sneering. I'm trying to find a place. Can I see the room? No, you're black <laughs> and I'm white. You she may not. I'm racist, bitch. <laughs> so sorry about that. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> So sorry, you have to deal with the presence of an African American. All the furniture is included. Closet's a decent size, and you even have your own bathroom, which is really nice. This is great. Oh, it's honestly everything I've been looking for. How do I apply? Shut up, fake redhead. Right here. Just fill out this application form, and don't worry. Most of the info on there is just for formalities. I don't really check it. Great. <laughs> okay, why the fuck are you? Go away, you fake redhead. I hate fake redhead. So, I love redheads. They're cuties. This is cringe. This is a woman. This is an obvious brunette painting her head, uh, her hair red in a hot topic fashion. Basically, just emptying out a spray can. I guess I don't even know what the fuck. Like, no. I'm gonna fill get this out. out right get now. out of my apartment. Get out of my apartment. Okay. The the poor black lady is way nicer than you. <laughs> I'd like to apply too. And how do you plan on affording to live here? Do you even have a job? Yes. Yes, I'm um, August because she's an imposter. Actually. She's really? not a real redhead. Or more like unemployed. <laughs> <laughs> I'd like to apply too. <laughs> and 
how do you plan on affording to live here? Do you even have a job? Yes, I'm self-employed, actually. Well, I think you're more like on food stamps. <laughs> oh my god. Self-employed? Are you sure? Really? Or more like unemployed. <laughs> Look, you can apply. But I'm telling you right now, I run criminal background checks. Nothing gets past me. <laughs> is there anything else you So prediction. Her homework is her application slash homework is going to be full of spelling errors and fuck ups and just her having 60 IQ and she's gonna smile and be like, yeah, this is perfect. And the black lady's application is gonna be immaculate. But denied. Because she's black. This is racist. Need. Let's see. Income looks good. Rental history looks great. Yeah, this is everything that I need. Normally yeah, perfect. I check and oh my for god. Income, but I can already tell that you're more than qualified. Oh, great, mm -hmm. Thanks. So. You look like a 30 year old stuck in the age of like Nickelodeon shows and like, you know, you, you look like you're trying to just fit in and with the today's teenagers. And you bought some paint from Hot Topic and painted your hair, but like, you're so perfect because you're white. How do I move forward? I just need a security deposit and first month's rent. Sweet. <laughs> um, <laughs> use my application. This should be interesting. <laughs> You make six figures a year. <laughs> right. <laughs> Called it. I'm gonna need to see proof of income. Never been late on rent. Highly doubt that. I'm gonna need to verify with your landlord. <laughs> I'm also gonna need to run credit and background on you. Okay, that's not a problem. I can get you everything that you need. But can I also place a deposit to reserve it? Look, it hasn't been easy for me to find something, and I don't want to lose this. You think I'm going to take a check from you? Get real. There's probably not even any money in that account. No, there's plenty Are of funds in Are you looking for a I lawsuit? It'll clear. This is how you get a lawsuit. Well, it wouldn't matter anyways, because Amy here has already been approved. And she's about to place a deposit. Right? Yes, I would love to, but um, actually, I only brought my checkbook, too. Oh, that's perfectly fine. I trust you. <laughs> Just make it out to Natalie Mitchell and the room is all yours. Oh my god! <laughs> Thank you so much! That's amazing! <laughs> wow. <laughs> Yikes, sweaty. Wow, oof. Oof, not a good look. Not a good look. Do better. Educate yourself. And take a check from her? But you won't take a check from me? That's Let's right. be honest. You all bounce checks all the time. You gotta be crazy if you think I'm gonna fall for that. Y'all, did you she just bounce see checks all the time? Let's be honest. You all bounce checks all the time. You gotta be crazy if you think I'm gonna fall for that. Is that what this is about? That's right. This. You know, it's about racism, girly. You really shouldn't judge someone before you get to know them. <laughs> <laughs> and you should really leave here before I call the cops. Mm-hmm. Yeah, huh? That's right. <gasps> because you're definitely not living here. That's right. Take your fake $20 checks and your fentanyl body out of here. Here's my check. <laughs> so when can I move in? You can now. move in right now if you want to. <laughs> I'm so excited to be roommate. Ah, uh, me too. <laughs> Roomies. Natalie is so happy she found the perfect roommate she was looking for. Or at least she thought. In the beginning, they both get along great and everything seems to be going amazing. <laughs> but then 
<laughs> a few weeks later, Natalie received and the check bounces. A letter from the bank telling her that Amy's check bounced. Ah, she couldn't it. believe it. What? A white woman's check bounced? When she confronts Amy How? about it, she finds out that Amy doesn't even have a real job. No. She can't even afford to pay the first month's rent. What? After living for free for a while, Amy eventually moves out. It turns out that even the Gucci bag she had on was fake. <gasps> no. Natalie couldn't believe how big of a mistake she made. Her Gucci bag was a fake? Without any help on rent, Natalie doesn't have enough money to pay for it and it ends up getting evicted from her apartment. I cannot believe this betrayal. Before long, Natalie is forced to look for a new room to rent. Um and she will have to rent from the black girl who makes six figures a year. Excuse me. I saw an ad that there's a room Called for it. rent. <laughs> you. <laughs> what are you doing here? I live here. What are you doing here? I thought you already had a roommate. Amy was her name? You tell her. Oh yeah, well, things didn't exactly work out with her. Let's just say people aren't always what they seem. So this is your home. It's Queso, really nice. Queso. <laughs> but how can you afford this? I mean, weren't you having trouble, like, affording an apartment? No, <laughs> she literally tried to cut you a blank check. What do you mean, having trouble affording a... Mm. Affording an apartment was never the issue. The issue... She's rich, bitch. Is that people were judging me. Yeah. You see... You see, like so I you see. Like I said rental application, I make great income. I'm the owner of an accounting firm and have lots of clients. The problem has never been with me qualifying for an apartment. I've never been behind on rent or made a late payment in my oh, what's life. What's her name? I've oh, that's not the name. Jackson Kyra. I don't know why I read that like Hispanic. Jackson Kira. Never been behind on rent or made a late payment in my life. The problem is with people judging me because of my looks. Mm hmm. You they tell don't her. Need rent to people like me. Mm hmm. Without even getting to know me. So and you now see, you're at my door. I wasn't having a hard time because so I wasn't. So you see, on the wedding night of my daughter, you come to me when you ask her favors. How dare you? Qualified. Wow, heavy. I'm really sorry for the way I treated you. Huh. You're right. I shouldn't have judged you before I got to know you. Well, I don't know if it's appropriate for me to ask, but are you still looking for a roommate? I really need to find a place. Yeah, cool. I'm sorry, Be homeless, bitch. But I don't think you are a good fit for what I'm looking for. I wish you the best of luck. But Kyra. And you Kyra. should probably leave before I call the cops. Because you are definitely not living here. That's right. You're trespassing. Get off my property. Hey, Darman fam, make sure to subscribe. Oh, that was abrupt. All right. <laughs> ah, that was a fun one. All right, guys, I think I'm going to go to sleep now. But uh, we had some fun tonight. We watched a bunch of Darman, straw man videos, and we finished in a single stream. We finished the whole last game. Erika. So thanks to all of you who bared with me through that. All right. Um, I'll see you guys next time. Maybe tomorrow. I cannot promise tomorrow, but definitely on Thursday because we're doing a charity stream on Thursday for autistic kids. You guys have a nice night and sleep.